will be adding extra floors to Brookhaven houses, but also I'll be doing many other secrets in Brookhaven. And at the end, I'll show you a house you should not get out or creepy things will happen. I found a way to add extra floors to your Brookhaven house. And as you can see, I found this YouTube video that says how to add extra floors to your house in Brookhaven. So we got to go and pick the house. As you can see, we have to get out this house right here. And we got hacker hacking 1 billion subs for cleanse. What? Cleanse needs 1 billion subs? Wait, cleanse needs 1 trillion subs. So you guess that the house right here is going inside. He's going inside. Okay. And what is he going to do inside? He's going to go over to like the TV section. Okay. So now he's going to go ahead and oh, he's going to open up the fridge. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, there's a hacker right next to my fridge, bro. Are you kidding me? You know what? Let me just open my fridge. Anyways, anyways. So now he's going to go ahead and he's going to get out something from the fridge, bro. Wait, you just, you just left your fridge open? Oh, he's going to get out like the small little car that your mom probably drives every day. Okay, so basically, let's get your mom's car. Well, yeah, there we go. There we go. But anyways, it's a car that drives, right? That drives very, very slowly. Okay, the dude, he's literally going across the Brookhaven map. Wait, where is he going? A car wash or what? Oh, he's going over to the secret base, I think. And wait, Jake, cleanse the best. Wait, why is Jake's face so mad? My mom's car is so slow, it can't beat a turtle. Okay, anyways, where are I, um, your mom's secret base? Wait, wh wh why did your mom keep it so dirty? Look at this. Oh my God. Wait a minute. He kind of looks like a mom. I'm not gonna lie. He's gonna go inside. Oh, your mom's gonna go ahead and turn everything on. Stop talking bad about my mom. I really shouldn't be doing that, but but it's kind of funny, you gotta admit. Let's go ahead and turn all these on. There we go. Now he's gonna, I'm not gonna do anything else and he's gonna go back to his mom's car, okay? All right, let's just get back in our car and never gonna give you, bro, I hate that. Okay, anyways, let's go. Let's go over here. I never wanna be given up. I never wanna be let down by this YouTube video. Your mom never let me down. Your mom never make me cry. Your mom never sell a lot. Never mind, never mind, everyone. Oh, finally, he's going back to his house. So he, now he's gonna go inside. Okay, he's finally gonna close the fridge. Oh no, the dinosaur went in my fridge. No! no! Please, no! I wanted to drink some soda and some milk that my dad never bring back. Eats. Oh my god, bro. Wait, I can still close. I can still close the white while he's eating up. There we go. Anyways, let's see what this mom does. Oh, the, the mom's gonna lock the house out. Oh, they're gonna take the slow car. And guess what? It's gonna take a billion years in order to go ahead and get to the next area. Oh my god, this is so boring, everyone. I'm gonna go sleep. Or you know what? Let's just do this. I'm gonna go sleep, you know, after this. I'm so tired of uh being bored of this TikTok. All right, anyways, let's lock our house. There we go. And I don't even know where I'm going. Oh my god, look at this. But your mom's car is so oh, what happened to your mom's car? What happened to your mom's car, bro? Oh, what's going okay? I don't know what happened to your mom's car, everyone. Your mom's car is a helicopter. Let's get the helicopter helicopter. Anyways, at least I hope your mom knows how to go ahead and uh, get extra floors in Brookhaven, though. All right, where is it going with your mom? mom's car. It's getting so boring. I'm so sleepy right now, too. Oh, town hall? Town hall? Where are we going? Wait, oh, we're going to the fire station, finally. All right, all right, finally. Oh, oh, no, wait, wait. What did the dinosaur name itself? Clund is ugly, and it has an axe. And oh my god, the dinosaur said slash dark? Wait, 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 what? wait. Oh my god, okay, I might actually get, get eaten by a dinosaur, but you know what? I'm, I'm gonna be sleeping while, while I get eaten by a dinosaur, because I'm so sleepy by, by, by getting bored of that YouTube video. It takes so long with, the, with their mom's car. Wait, 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 wait. The fresh is okay, okay. How do I lock myself? I'm gonna lock myself. No! Wait, wait. Dinosaurs are pretty, like, dumb, right? So I'm, I'm gonna get the dinosaurs back and I'm gonna close these. There we go. Close this. No, go. No, no. I closed it myself. You know what? You know what? I'm, I'm gonna go really far away. I'm gonna go real far away. Now I can go. Come on, come on, come on. Now I can close real quick. Come on. Oh! Ah, ha, ha, ha. Oh, wait, wait, bro. Yeah. Who, who, who opened it? Oh, my God, bro. Who opened it? All right. Let's go outside. Let's go outside. Come on. Co co come here, dinosaur. Come on. Now close it. Oh, no. Wait. I'm gonna give up. All right. Now what happens? Now what happens? Okay. Okay, now he's gonna wait. He's gonna do something. He's gonna close that, and he's gonna find an extinguisher, and he's gonna open it up, and he's gonna okay. So first you close the thing, okay. Now we're gonna get the fire extinguisher. Now we're gonna open the thing, and let's get out of here. All right, now what happens? Now he's gonna go straight up your mom's road. Oh, okay. He's gonna go straight up your. Mom. Oh, he's gonna turn right on your mom's road too. Okay. Come on, bro. He's gonna go, but he's gonna finally go ahead and get double floors in Brookhaven now. He's gonna get extra floors in Brookhaven. Like that's all I wanna know. Like I don't even care about the mom jokes or anything like that. Like all I wanna know is if he gets gonna get the extra floors okay so now he's gonna go over to his house okay and now he's gonna open up his house finally because it was locked right and wait what happened to his fire oh my god there's fire here he's gonna try to put up the fire okay okay dinosaur's like blue right here you know what i'm gonna use the fire shoot on dinosaur hey get out of here dinosaur boom oh this actually looks like something's coming out of the back of the car whenever i'm holding out the fire shoes that actually looks pretty cool cleanse dinner is ready um my, my, my mom cleanse the best oh my mom my, my mom hi sorry for taking your car you know you grounded for what? Wait, she grounded for him one second? Wow, I love you, mom. Smiley face, look at this. My mom's kind of too kind, I guess, because I should have gotten grounded, but I really did it. Oh, wait, let's fire. Sure, sure, sure. Oh my god, there's fire over here. Let's fire. Sure, sure. Come on, go, go, go. The fire go away. Okay, now what's gonna happen? He's gonna fire. Sure, sure, that, okay. And he's gonna, is the fire gonna go away? Okay, now he's gonna fire. Sure, sure, and he's gonna turn off the fire. Okay, okay. And now 
what is he gonna do? Now he's gonna go ahead and go upstairs like your mom did. Okay, okay anyways, <laughs> we're gonna fire your chest a little bit more. And now we're gonna go ahead and turn this off. There we go. And boom, the fire turned off. And now we're gonna go up the stairs. Okay, now what's gonna happen? He's, he's gonna go inside the bedroom. And what is he gonna do? Wait, what? Bro, he just goes to that bedroom and doesn't even go, doesn't even do anything. Okay. Oh, he's gonna go up there. Oh. Oh, he's gonna use a ladder to get up there. Well, you don't even need to use the ladder to get up there, but I guess he's gonna use it. But is there where you add the extra floors? I don't know. So I'm, I'm just gonna go inside because uh, I know the comments are gonna be like, oh my God, cleanse did not go inside there. And that's why the TikTok did not work or the YouTube video did not work. And he, did, he, can't, he can't get the extra floors in Brookhaven. Well, I actually did that, all right? Next, all we need to do is go over to the backpack and then uh, and then, and then get up with the ladder. There we go. We got a ladder right here. Now we're gonna put the ladder right here. Now we're gonna go up here. Now we're gonna go up here. There we go. Wait, hold up. Do we need to climb the crystals in order to go ahead and add extra floors? I don't know. Oh my God. Wait, I thought that was my mom. Oh, my mom's right there. My mom's right there. Did my mom bring dinner to me? That's such a mom thing to do. Anyways, let's see what happens here. She's, he's gonna go up here. Come on, go up, go up, go up, go, 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 go. Okay, now he's gonna go and click on that. Okay, um, and do I get extra floors if I click on that? Like, sir? All right, sir. Um, click, 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 click. There we go. Your mom is clicking right here. Okay, he's gonna go and click, click. And he's gonna go click, 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 click right there. But now what is he gonna do? Like, uh, do we get extra floors now or something? Like, I, I just wanna get rid of this. I get rid of this video. He's gonna put a sleeping bag right there. Oh, and what is he gonna do with the sleeping bag? Nothing. All right, bro. Let's just go over to our backpack and get a sleeping bag out. There we go. And let's just put the sleeping bag right here. Okay, and then let's just try to glitch in right here. Oh, oh, oh my god. I, I just thought I got like an extra floor or something because like it glitched out. And look, look at these solar panels, everyone. These solar panels actually look cool. Okay. He's gonna try to get up there. Are you gonna try to get up there, bro? Wait, bro. Bro, what is he doing? Bro thinks that's funny. <laughs> bro thinks wasting my time is funny, bro. I am so mad at that guy right now. Can you at least show us? You know what? I'm, I'm gonna skip to the end of the video. Wait, I actually just had a laptop. Maybe we gotta get a laptop. You know what? I'm just gonna get a laptop. Okay, there we go. Let's get at this. And and come on, bro. I'm trying to go to sleep right now. My computer just green. Wait, just like his computer, right? Yeah. His computer in the video, as you can see, it's kind of green right here. So what is he going to do with the computer, bro? Oh, he, I think he pressed F because it has F2 right here. Let's go ahead and go back to our thing right now. And we're going to place an F right here. And um, wait, it turned blue instead of, wait, hold on. Let's look at this thing right here, right? Because wait, his thing turned blue. Oh my God. I think ours might work. I think ours might work. Oh my God. Okay. Now, now he's going to put it with the computer. Now he's going to put it with the computer. So now we're going to put it with the computer as well. There we go. Boom. And now we're going to go over to him. And uh, what is he going to do? Try to jump in there again, bro. Oh, he's gonna go down. He's gonna go down. Now he's gonna go to the bathroom. Okay, let's let's try to go to the bathroom. Like, still okay. Now he's gonna go to the bathroom. Okay, now what is he gonna do? Oh, he's gonna go on the house controls. Okay, oh, he's gonna go on this or something. And the video ended there. All right, let's just try this. Um, okay, let's go to end the video. And here's the part where he goes down. And uh, wait, what does he do? Wait, he goes over here. He goes over there. And then goes down. Whoa, okay, I don't even know what he's doing. And then he goes to the house controls. And he clicks on the house con. Oh, he's gonna go on the uh, controls button located above. What is he gonna do? Does he does he add anything? Wait, um, okay, let's click on this. Better go to sleep right now. It says house control buttons also located above. Okay, let's go to here. Here's how you can add extra floors to your Brookhaven house. Isn't this crazy? Yeah. I'm also going to show you a creepy chairman glitch, a secret invisibility glitch, where you can literally go invisible, a secret hidden spot at the school that you didn't know about, and a Brookhaven scary secret from this TikTok. So it says, why did you follow me? And wait a minute, what's going to happen here? So first, it seems like she's going to get her own motorcycle. Or right, next, we have to go inside of this house right here and grab a flashlight. All right, and oh my God, what? People have already gotten these houses out over here. I guess I'm going to have to get my own house over here. I bet this secret is going to be fake and there's no way you can add extra floors to your Brookhaven house. Well, you know what? I bet this is not going to be. And I think the house was, oh, this house right here. Okay. We're going to see if we can prove the haters wrong. He says, go through this wall. Wait, what? I didn't even know you can go through that wall over there. There's no way it will work. What if it does? Exactly. What if it literally does right now? Okay, let's go down here. It won't. Don't be supportive. Oh my God. Wait, people are actually going through it. Wait, wait, they went through it. Okay, let me go through it. And oh my God, there's a secret room. But later in this video, we're going to see a secret hidden spot at the school and how to add extra floors to your Brookhaven house. House, which is crazy. Next, apparently there's secret cubes in Brookhaven, and we're gonna be looking at each location, starting off with the criminal base. It seems okay. And if you didn't know, there's actually a secret way to go to the criminal base, where you go through the pool like this. And you know, for this one, I'm gonna get a flashlight out because it's gonna be super duper dark. Once you go through this pathway, you go over here, and I wonder what, what all the secret cube location is gonna be. Okay, we're gonna go down here. Apparently, it's down here, like secret cube. Next, let's see where the secret cube is. Apparently, this is every single secret cube that you can find in Brookhaven. And oh my god, wait, there it actually is right there. There's no way there's a secret cube. It did last. Time. Yeah, but that was only one worthless secret. Oh, really? Let me just get the sleeping bag, and apparently he put the sleeping bag right here, and you go like this. Okay, let's actually see if there's a secret cube. Wait, there's no way. There's nothing in here. Are you kidding me? I didn't work. But hopefully this one works because
because apparently this is a super secret item in Brookhaven. Trust me, you want to know this? Yeah, you want to know how to get the extra force as well, but apparently you got to go to the secret hospital hole and click on that. Oh, look at the hater. She's like all the way over there while I'm just quickly going over to the hospital. It's probably fake just like you are. That's so mean, but we got to make it through the crack and go to the extra room. That's not nice. Dude, exactly, but apparently there's a crack. Oh, look at this. There's a crack right here that we can go through. Okay, yeah, let's go through here and we're going to escape from the Karen, all right? Let's get escape from the Karen. Okay, over oh, at the extra room. Okay, we got to go over here. Well, and then it says the people that are watching have not subscribed and like like and subscribe or you'll be doomed forever yo this guy is begging for likes and subscribers but he's gonna jump over the thing and then we literally have to jump over this that's your scan because there's something wrong with you psycho brain go get some help we have to prove this hater wrong this has to be right all right let's go over here and you know what ultimately i'll prove them wrong with the added extra floors on your brookhaven house but we gotta go over here this isn't a secret i've seen this before bro there's more to the tiktok and wait he clicks on the, the short went too fast but like the short video it says okay we gotta click on this the papers right there and i'm gonna run over for the camera let's go let's go to the barn imagine being a fake click on paper won't get you an item you stupid so call the wizard go to a psychologist bro well i don't need to go to a doctor you need to go to a doctor come on let's go oh look at this we're gonna go in this car to the barn over there and test the secret you cheap car too cheap this is expensive car bro wait what do you mean that's like the cheapest car ever that's a free car what is that exactly bro what is that but at the barn we have to go on that button and go back to the hospital okay let's quickly do this apparently there's a button up here okay let's go let's go let's go i'm gonna climb up here and apparently there's a button up wait and yo there's a secret paper over here and oh my god look at that beautiful button she appears and once you click on it bro it turns red Lo, the karen's gonna be oh. mad stop being mean to my pookie karen right she's mean in the first place anyway it seems like after clicking on the button we have to go back to the hospital and jump over here and yo my friend just took me to the hospital yo with this expensive car i have a good feeling this is gonna work yeah this is definitely gonna work i'm unlike how the karen said and the extra floors as well so next we gotta go in the emergency room i believe and oh yeah he said uh, around the x-room right here and i'm pretty sure we gotta hop okay I'm, I'm gonna see the karen's reaction you know the karen's reaction wait where's the karen even at? oh here's karen's friend okay karen's friend let's go okay well, i think we have to jump up here jump over here and oh my god he's not the secret item oh my god there's no way you psycho but next let's look at this cool secret we have to get at this house right here we're finally gonna be able to prove karen wrong with the secret as well all right i believe the house they got up was this house right here there we go poor house bro you literally need premium to get this house up. you can't even prove us wrong there's no way you can add extra for sure bro Kevin house he can prove your karen wrong exactly i can do it but let's actually see what the secret is okay you go down here okay 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 what happens oh he's gonna sleep back okay and then he gets a ladder are we gonna glitch into a secret place that the karen doesn't know about hopefully that adds extra floors to my brookhaven house who knows because um there's already extra floors below if you know what i mean so we gotta go down here look at this extra floors below and all i need is a sleeping bag that i already got out and i need a ladder there we go boom I, and i'm pretty sure okay we gotta put a ladder somewhere okay he's gonna put the ladder right there and a sleeping bag right there and oh all, right, all we need to do is put the ladder right here the carriage right here she's literally gonna be looking at it. and then all we gotta do is put the sleeping bag come on show me how to get extra floors if you could you psycho bro what do you mean i'm a psycho okay we're gonna go up i'm in the secret room the karen but believe it or not there's actually even more to the secret because there's more seconds in this video we're gonna prove karen wrong multiple times so wait oh um okay that's interesting we gotta get this house out and then apparently he actually goes invisible i'm gonna tell karen i'm gonna go invisible i can add extra floors just like this look at this i can literally add it like this and uh, it's gonna be super cool all right but first i'm pretty sure they got a, a house that looks like this huh let's look at the house oh all right, i think the house is this one right here wow look at this poor house wait what do you mean it's a poor house dude it's a big house it's even got like a hot tub up here imagine not being red look at my professional and ethical house bro wait um uh, uh, bro the monkey's literally saying on my shoulder that this house is pretty poor what the l house exactly it's super l but wait a minute this guy's gonna go up and then apparently he's gonna go invisible wait there's a person right at the toilet bro what and then he's gonna wait he's gonna click on that thing and he's gonna get hurt and wait a minute and then what else oh and then oh i'm gonna do this right now i'm gonna do this. i'm gonna go invisible and brook him and karen and i'm gonna add extra floors just like this i wonder how many floors i could add by the end of the video you know what i mean that's impossible stupid no brainer so we have to go over here we have to go up and he was very very tiny so i'm pretty sure we have to be tiny as well so um let's be like 0.5 i'm doing the secret as well oh really wait this guy knows the secret that's why he's small but he's taller than me short purple bean hey yo hey, why are they calling me a purple bean bro i mean i even have the monkey look at beam me the monkey right here huh shorty shoddy wait what does that even mean you're shorter than me and i'm tiny bro why is everyone making fun of me just because i'm short and 
hey, they robbed my safe. Okay, you know what? Okay, let's get her. And what's about to happen next? And wait, wait, what did he do? How did he go invisible? Wait, I didn't see. Oh, he closed out. Oh, and then the person, wait, wait, the person's probably gonna come out, dude. That's gonna be so funny. Time to get revenge on the Karen. We're gonna click on her out there. Boom, and yo, I went invisible. Yo, the other guy got invisible too. What? What am I just saying? I'm hacking low, bro. I can't let Tony. We're just gonna start. I can get the creepy chairman right here in Brookhaven. And then we're gonna see how to get extra floors as well. And also wait for the secret hidden spot at the school that you didn't know about. Okay, first we have to go to the um rotten uh, cemetery, and then we have to go to oh chief rotten at the town. Oh, wait, town hall. Okay, and then we're gonna go up here. That's very interesting. Are right, we're at the Brookhaven Cemetery right here? And wait a minute, wait, it does say I'm a rotten, but I, I, I can kind of change it, but I'm pretty sure that's what it says usually. You know what? I'm gonna try the secret from the video. Let's go. Okay, so we gotta go to the town hall right here, right? Okay, gonna go over here, and then wait, uh, I'm gonna swim a little bit, and then I'm gonna go over here, and look at this chief rotten. Oh my god, chief rotten. Oh my god, I'm sorry, you had to win. Bro, wait, 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 uh, wait, 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 is that Chief Rod? You better run. Wait, what? Oh my god, oh, the creepy chair, man, isn't it scary? And oh, we gotta go to the hospital and call on that thing, and we gotta sit as well, and what the, wait, what is that? Even me, yo, yo, Chief Rod's following me, bro, we gotta run. Okay, let's go over here, and I guess we gotta click on, okay, we gotta click on this thing over here, and we gotta sit, huh? Wait, once we sit, what's gonna happen? Hey, yo, what are those codes? You know what, let's keep watching the TikTok, and get the creepy chair, man, okay, we gotta get the book at the library. Yo, there's Chief Ron right there. Oh my god, wait, wait, wait. Yo, is that the Oh my god, he's gotta go. Then, okay, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna get the I'm gonna get the book. Yo, is that Chief Ron? Yo, I don't know who's gonna be at the library. Look at him. Yo, he's right here. Run, run, run. Oh well, I got the book. Okay, now we gotta go over here and click on the museum. Okay. That's super easy. We can go over to the museum. Oh, look, this is the museum. You're so old. What does that mean? Only old people go to the museum. Bro, I'm going to the museum to see how to do the creepy magic. Oh my god, wait. There's gonna be you know what? I'm gonna scare them with the goes and then right after that we're gonna see the creepy chair mate okay we're gonna put the book wait like right here okay okay wait the ghost goes up here oh my god yes look at this look at this oh my god oh my god oh bro this guy's running away we are oh my god bro wait they ran away oh that's funny that ghost is ugly like you hey yo what do you mean and wait why is there another ghost over here it's me poison livy and also find out how i can you know add extra floors in the real brookhaven not um not not a brookhaven that i can add infinite extra i can actually like literally add infinite extra floors in the brookhaven but i want to see like who poison livy actually is so we're gonna go over here and uh bro what the yo wait that's the actual poison livy wait oh poison you wait um you know you know what we better run away but next after this what do we need to do okay the creepy ghost is up there and then wait a minute we gotta get out oh that house right there oh i know that house all right there it is i'm gonna get it out boom look at this ah uh, beautiful bakery nothing can go wrong right we gotta go inside and we gotta click on the button under the bed all right we gotta go inside and we gotta click on the button under the bed wait wh why is it so quiet wait why is no one here i don't see any karens or anything um you know what it's actually peaceful it's actually peaceful okay we're gonna go in the bedroom and we're gonna click on the button right yeah yeah the button right under here there we go look at this. wow that's super cool oh wait wait we took oh is, is that poison livy um that we saw and wait a minute wait is that chief rock bro chief rock time to turn it green yo yo i'm ready going yo okay here oh my god okay wait there's no way there's no way oh my god you know what? i'm gonna lock the house i'm gonna lock the house oh my god i don't want to get poisoned before i you know i get infinite floors or add extra floors to my brookhaven house but before that we obviously need to go ahead and get the creepy chairman okay we gotta ring the bell and then get that wait who is this spark plug and wait who is that join the dark side oh wait wait wait, wait what no 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 i'm not gonna join the dark side okay let, let's go over to the church and we're gonna ring the bell why does this guy have an axe you're stuck with brookhaven's most wanted wave one wait 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 what is that wait they're brookhaven's most wanted wait a minute let's actually go over there there's no way they're actually spawning the people at the, the town hall i mean this might be a secret before we can check out the creepy chair man um but wait let's look at this um we got chief rotten um i don't know where he is we got poison eevee we have moon star and then we got spark plug wait you have two spark plugs bro we're scared of the creepy chair man oh really oh, oh um um okay i am totally uh not doing a secret to get him you know what i mean yeah good and yo wait why is she frying here as well bro wait we literally have one two three four four people on this brookhaven most wanted bro these these guys must have done really bad things all right but next we gotta go to the arch and get the stick and hopefully after that this beautiful creepy chairman we can scare them with and obviously i didn't forget about the extra floors because that's why you clicked on the video right or right, we're gonna go to the arch right here and then we're gonna click right here wait wait oh look at this. i got the stick i got this oh stick wait why are they running away because of the stick wait this, this girl's running away too wait oh we gotta go to like the museum 
museum and then we gotta like use a stick. Wait, it's just destroy the stick. Hey, hey, no, 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 no. You guys are not destroying the stick. We're literally gonna get it right here. Yo, yo, they're changing it, bro. Are you kidding me? They're changing it. They're not letting me do it. Come on, museum. Oh my god, do it. Yes. Oh my god. Oh, bro, what? Oh, look at this. They're blocking with their body. Oh, yeah. Okay, let me do it first. Bro, what the? Ha ha ha. We won't let you. Oh, really? Um, wait, wait. Could you turn around? Um, there is a secret ghost there. You know what I mean? Oh, wait, it's actually, wait, it's actually turned it back, bro. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I'm gonna go right here. Wait, is it? Oh my god, it worked. Oh, oh my god, okay. I think that's all I needed to do. Because that's all I saw on the TikTok. Creepy chairman, here we come. Okay, let's actually see the creepy chairman. Oh my god, I'm so excited for this one. Okay, next, we gotta go all the way over to. Oh, I think the abandoned house. Do y'all wanna go on a trip? Because I have the perfect trip for you all. Okay. Yeah. You know what? We're, we're gonna go on a field trip. So, why, why do we get a scuba? This should be called the most wanted scuba. Wait, the most wanted scuba. And, bro, wait. Queen, bro. I think I saw Queen Cobra right there. Yo. Okay, this is going interesting, all right? And it was, oh, yeah, we got the prison bus right here. Yeah, let's go to the uh, abandoned house and uh, check out the creepy chairman. We'll, we'll go to the abandoned house. I really hope the creepy chairman's here. We're here. Oh, my God. The creepy chairman's here. Oh, my God. It actually worked. Oh, oh my God. Queen Cobra is leaving. Look at her. Yo. Wait, Moonstar. Wait. Oh. Wait, wait. What just happened? Wait, wait. Moonstar just disappeared with the smoke. And wait, um, cotton candy Samola. Wait, what does that even mean? Since that worked, I wonder if this one's going to work. We're, we're going to get infinite floors to our Brooklyn house, bro. Infinite floors. Oh my God. That's going to be insane. Or like extra floors to our Brooklyn house at least. You know what I mean? Yeah, there we go. Look at that. <laughs> but before we do that, we have a secret room at the school or right above the school right here to check out. All right, this is going to be insane. And, and you can literally type in numbers. And yo, this seems like a creepy room that all the ghosts would be in here. You know what I mean? Or like the, all the most wanted Brooklyn players. And yo, um, that's super crazy. Okay, first we have to find the seven crystals around Brookhaven. Wait, what? Now, okay, we have to go to the town hall. All right, we gotta go to the town hall and then go to city and power. Okay, okay, we gotta change this and then go to the school roof. All right, let's just see if this actually works because right now, I have to get to it. There's no secret room above the school and I really want to prove all the haters wrong. So we're at the town hall and a bro. Um, I hate seeing smoke like that, but you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna click, click over here and then we gotta, we gotta switch it up. Okay, 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 okay. Then we gotta go back. Then we gotta go back. Okay, I, I hope this works. Wait, what? Okay, I guess there are more steps not working. I've literally got a video on how to get in the secret hidden room inside of the school, right? And we're actually going to see this. Okay, first, we got to go be in the extra room. We got to click on that. I think we've already done it. We're literally doing all the things that we've already done. Are you kidding me right now? Wow, wow. Bro, the monkey is like, he literally needs bananas. You know, okay, uh, it's, it's okay, monkey. Uh, we'll, we'll get you the banana. We clicked on that. After this, I really want to see how to get extra floors to my broken in a house just like this. <laughs> Imagine having this many floors. What would y'all do? Wait, apparently we need the blue key card. Come on, come on. Let's go in. Oh, chief bro. My station. I mean, I guess you are a chief, but you know what, chief? I don't care. I really need to get the secret to prove that Karen wrong, right? That that called me, that called my secrets fake. For no reason, right? Like, be, be, even be me disagrees with that, right? Wah, wah. Bro, he's like, he's like, he only disagrees if I give him the banana. But anyways, oh wait, this key card's right there. I got the key card. I don't even care. All right, now let's get out of here from the Brookhaven police vents. And then according to the video, bro, this video better be true. We have to go to near Lake Madison and be into this room. And then we got to type in our Roblox username. Okay, this is pretty basic stuff. Anyways, okay, we're, we're at the lake over here and near the lake. Look at this. We got the Brookhaven Electrical. We're gonna go through this. I'm gonna put mine. Let's just put enter. A password to prove. Alright, next. Where is he going, bro? Where is he going with the skateboard? Okay. He just looked on the camera right there. Yo! We gotta call on the camera. I really hope this works, alright? I really, really hope this works. Okay, okay. We're gonna call on the camera. We're gonna call on the camera. There we go. Next, we gotta go to the Brookhaven Electric and or, or Brookhaven Town Hall and then we gotta turn all these uh this way. Okay. All three of them. And then we gotta turn this one on and that one off. Interesting. Brookhaven is a very interesting game. Uh, don't you agree? Whoa, whoa. Bro, baby literally needs the bananas. Uh, I'll give it to you yeah. later. Uh, we're at the Brookhaven City and like, okay, we gotta turn this game. We gotta turn that on. And then we gotta turn three of them like that and one of them like that. Okay, yeah. Or oh, wait, bro, in the video was like, wait, hold on. Um, I'm kind of getting confused. I think it was like this. One of them like that. Okay, that. And then wait a minute. You gotta turn this off and turn this on. Oh, there we go. Yes. This bro literally confused me in the video, bro. Look at what he does. He turned that on and turned that off. Wait, next we gotta go back to the next room and go to the secret room. Wait, yo, there's a cube right here in the inside of the secret location. What? I don't even know. Maybe this was one of the secret cubes of the second thing. I didn't even do this method. Oh my god, I'm kind of dumb. But the second secret actually worked, and the haters are wrong. Wait a minute, does that mean if I go to the criminal base right now, uh, by going over here, by going down here, you know, going down here? You know, my god, wait, there's a carbon block right here as well. Okay, wait, apparently you can click on it, or wait, can I click on it? I, I, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure the first one I gotta click on is over at the criminal base over here. We click on this, we go down here. Oh my god, okay, we're gonna see the secret school base then okay i really want to see what the secret is, is school base is and wait uh wait where is the crystal oh there it is i can click on it 
Okay. Oh my god, bro. The carbon box. I kept on it. Let's go. All right, so the second secret cube is going to be like right here, bro. Okay, we got to go over here. We got to get this. So we got to go over here. Baby. There we go. Boom. Come on. Let me get there. This. And oh my god, the second secret group. Yo, we can click on this. Yes. They're working. Wow. Exactly, Chief Rotten. They're working. Wow. Yeah, the haters are wrong. So my TikToks, my secrets do work. I don't even know that. Anyways, we're going to put this thing back right here next to the bank area. You know what I mean? So we're going to do right here. And apparently there's a bro. Okay, I don't even know where I glitched into. Where's the secret cube? Oh, wait. Oh, this is interesting. Maybe we got a glitch in here because apparently the secret cube somewhere right here. Oh, there it is. Oh my god. Okay, how do I click on it? Boom. Click on it. Boom. Energy captured three. Okay, we're going to put the ladder right here. Then we're going to put the sleeping bag right here. Then we're going to hop on the sleeping bag. Come on. Please, please let me hop on the sleeping bag. Maybe I have to be a little smaller so it's a little easier for me. You know what? That side doesn't work, I guess. So I'm going to uh, do the other way where you put the ladder over here. Then you just basically put, put the sleeping bag like over the roof. And then, oh my god, this is going to work. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna, I want to put their Karen's wrong and wait. Uh, where is it? Okay. I think you can see the crystal right there. And then you can see the cube right here. Click on the cube. Captured four. Let's go. All right. Next, we're going to go near the grocery store, bro. This is so close. Okay. We're going to go to the, the grocery store. It's like right here at the church. You know, wait, that, that's the church. Wait, where's the church at? Uh, hello? Here's like the auto shop. Here's like the church. And it's like going to be like right here where you have to put sleeping bag. And then, oh my God. Yes. I, I need to capture five. And then what else? What else? What else? What else? Oh my God. I'm going to see the secret room right now. Okay. Next, we got to go to the way. Oh, we got to go for the movies, right? Because the movies are over there. Oh, look at everyone jumping just like me. Let's go to the movies. Then we're going to go uh, put the ladder or not put the sleeping bag, I mean, and then we'll go over here. Wait, uh, hello? Can I go over here? And yo, here's the cube right here. Click on the cube right now. Ooh, energy capture six. All right, energy capture seven. Next, we got to go over here inside here. Oh, that's the seventh one and that's the ending. Yeah. And I really hope I get the secret school after this. And wait a minute, that was the first one we saw, right? Bro, that was literally the first one we saw and that's going to be the last one we got to click on. Are you kidding me right now? So we're going to click on it right now. And energy cap to seven. And then wait, what's going to happen? I apparently, uh, oh, I got teleported. Bro, wait, this is a black arch. Oh my God, it turned into a black arch for a second right there. Yo, behind me, there's like a trail. Oh, okay, that's super cool. All right, next, they're going to click on the barn button, which I think we've literally already done. Yeah, we already clicked on it. To wait, TS level one authorized. I don't even know what that means. Anyways, the end of the video next, what do we need to do, bro? Okay, wait, he's going to, the where is he going? Oh, to the, oh, we're going to go all the way to the abandoned house. Let's go to the abandoned house. Boom. You got to go over here. Wait, I think, and I think we got to click on the button like right here. Wait, how do, oh, I'm going to click on it. Yo, seven energy crystals released. A19 numeric sequence approved. I don't even know what that means. But I do know I want to get to the school. And oh my God, apparently now we're able to go to the hidden room in the school. And next we'll be able to get deep infinite floors. You know what I mean? This is going to be awesome. I'm here to help. Thank you, man. Thank you. Okay. He's going to be here to help. Let's go. All right, let's go over here. Oh my God, is it going to work? Is it going to work? Is it going to work? Okay, we're going to go over here. Moment of truth. Uh, did we miss something? Yes, we did miss something because um, we have to change that from high to low. Okay, that's interesting. All right, all right let's do this, bro. Um, That's interesting. Bro, didn't even tell me. The video guy didn't even tell me. He keeps switching it, bro. Are you kidding me right now? So we're, we're just going to do this, this, this. There we go. Okay, let's see if this works. No, it doesn't work. Wait, bro, I didn't even know we got to collect all the crystals. Okay, all the crystal locations. Come on. Okay, we got to collect on that. Come on, bro. Give me the crystal location right now, all right? The first crystal's way above here. Okay. This is the longest secret just to get into the secret room in the school. Are you <gasps> kidding me? I wonder how short or long the secret for uh the infinite floors. Wait, infinite floors in Brookhaven is going to be like, you know what I mean? I really want to get infinite floors in Brookhaven. How to get in, uh, how to get like extra floors in my Brookhaven house. Even, even if I get like one extra floor, I'll be happy. Anyways, okay. We got to go up here. Okay. Then we got to wait. Oh, bro. This guy just sitting here, bro. Yo, this is where the secret crystal is. Wait a minute. I got a secret trick up on my sleeve. You know how we got um this, right? <laughs> I got the shopping cart. Get out of here, buddy. And we're going to click on it. Let's go, bro. Let's go. One energy captured out of one. All right. Where's the next energy, buddy? Buddy, show me the next energy crystal. Okay. Next, we got to go to the church to get the next energy crystal. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's right here. Bro, how do people even find these secrets? Like, that's the most hidden secret ever. Like, that's the most hidden thing ever, bro. Are you kidding me right now? Okay. We're going to go over here next to the plant. We're going to click on this. There we go. Energy two out of uh, two energy crystal capture out of two. We're going to capture seven, which I think we're going to do just because it's going to be super duper easy. All right. Next. Wait, is, is that the motel over there or not, not the motel, but I guess like the abandoned house or the haunted house or whatever you call it, honestly, because no one literally goes out across this town because there's nothing over here. Okay. We're over here. Let's go. We're going to get the third crystal. We're going to get third crystal. And where's the third crystal? Um, there it is. Thank you for the third crystal. Three uh, energy capture out of three. Ooh, ah, ooh, ah. Bro, Beamy literally needs another banana. Are you kidding me, Beamy? We're not giving you another banana. We're going to go to another way. Wait, we're going to go behind the 
the way Brookhaven Arch and bro what there's another one hidden there or the Brookhaven sign I guess oh Luffy let's go to the Brookhaven si sign oh my god yes the billboard it's gonna be next to the Black Hawk I guess yeah Black Hawk community wow the Black Hawk community are pretty cool okay wait I think it might be somewhere on here come on come on come on um there it is oh my god yes yes I saw it okay give me that let's go four out of four energy crypts are castered we need three more and we're gonna get the secret school I guess our secret school base yo let's go we're getting this super fast and next we gotta go wait oh to the horses bro this is this is the most hidden spots how do people even find this they were all say geniuses all right buddy take me to the stables buddy uh that looks like an anime okay we're gonna bring the stables over here and oh my god yes another crystal bro five out of five energy crystal oh it's gonna be at the okay i know where this location is and i can literally teleport to it because i think it's the north estate right i think it's like literally near the north estate okay let's go to the north estate right now bro oh, come on, come on, come on. okay uh wait uh wait a minute hey there we go north estate i think it's literally near the north estate somewhere so i think it's gonna be somewhere on here come on give me a rainy ale there it is oh my god yes yes near the north estate it's like really to right here uh i love the north estate six uh, energy crystals captured and apparently the seventh one is gonna be i think it's gonna be at the barn right that's what this guy said oh my god we're at the barn we're at the barn we're at the barn and then we're gonna go over here come on this yes energy crystals are waiting for power and yo um i just got teleported over here and i got another okay instead of like the black it, it, we got light okay i really hope this actually works and the haters get hated on right or the haters like what am i saying get proven wrong they're also gonna get proven wrong by the infinite floors you know how to add uh floors to your brick hand house anyways uh, we fought hard and long for this i bet this won't work ugly it's gonna work i bet it is yeah yeah it's gonna work let's let's go let's go let's go okay we're literally gonna see if this is gonna work um why is the auditorium like okay why is this screen behind here um i'm kind of getting scared a little bit but i'm pretty sure it's gonna work so we're gonna go up here oh my god oh my god it's literally gonna work right now wait oh my god oh my god wait oh uh, are you kidding me i literally did everything in the video yo someone switched the voltage are you kidding me okay we're gonna switch it back and then we're gonna switch it back like that okay how about now oh my god oh my god it actually worked oh my god wait no way okay now for the extra floors added you know what i mean to the brick haven house you're a double hey thanks bro there's no way that will work oh well i have a, a another video for that right oh wait how do i go back up uh, how do we go back out wait are we stuck here oh there it is oh my god i, I don't even know my way around here okay let's just find a video that shows us exactly how to do this all right so apparently we gotta get a penthouse apartment and which one do we have to get out? okay penthouse apartment all right which one are we gonna get out okay we're gonna get out the which one? Oh wait which one uh is he gonna get out that one right there or that one right there uh okay he's gonna get out that one right there okay 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 that looks like a extra floors in a break game i'm not gonna lie all right so first we need to go and get the luxury wait not the luxury apartment but the penthouse apartment and then we gotta get out this one okay i really hope this works i really hope we can get multiple floors in break because um that's always been my dream you know like to have like an apartment floor like this yo this is like this this kind of looks like crazy i don't i don't even know i can't even describe it like this is like imagine being on top of here yo like you literally have the whole view of brookhaven there's no way it will work you have a terrible apartment oh really i have a terrible apartment i bet she's gonna get a bad apartment but anyway so look at this yo we have two floors but i want to get even more floors i want to get three floors because i don't i have not seen a three four brookhaven house let's see what this guy says all right okay he's gonna go in there okay yeah you you you, you got you got like the apartment i literally got the same apartment that you got all right like i literally need to prove this karen wrong let me know exactly what type of apartment i need to get out bro okay now what he's gonna do he's, he's gonna like run around okay now bro what are, what am i supposed to do now bro 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 just stop showing me that bro like i can literally do the same thing wait how can i do it uh wait oh there we go look at this i can literally do that same thing too look at this bro look at this i, I can literally do the same thing you know i got two floors right here i can go in and wait hopefully nothing's bad wait i don't even wear a mask bro this is like the moon star whatever whoever it is right oh my god yeah but i don't even know where i'm at wait where's cleanse beam at bro wait did i just get kidnapped or something hold on let me just see oh bro i just got kidnapped ain't no way i just got kidnapped bro okay i'm getting out of here oh my god i got kidnapped i can literally do the same thing but i want to get three floors bro are you kidding me okay what are you gonna do what are you gonna show me come on i want to get extra floors in my broken house come on please okay we gotta go down here and then he's gonna show us okay luxury apartment no you can't get that out you have to get your friend to get it out all right friend 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 friend, friend. um someone uh get out an apartment you know what i mean uh, like the same when i got out all right i guess you gotta get a, this one right here your your friend below um but your friend above is gonna get out the one okay i've literally done what the youtube video said i really hope i can get extra floors all right all right come on come on what is the youtube video gonna say okay next oh so you gotta give him roommate the friends gotta give you roommate all right okay, okay. uh we gotta go up to uh the main floor 
her up here. I'm gonna be like, um, friend or catnap, bro. Wait, this is literally catnap from like, wait, that's literally catnap from Poppy Playtime. Hey, hey, uh, give me roommate, give me roommate, give me roommate, give me roommate. Done. Wait, done. Wait, that means I can literally do anything I want here. Wait, wait, I can literally lock the doors. Oh, this is my own apartment now. Wow. I can literally click on this. Yo, I can go anywhere I want in this apartment. Let's go. I've literally done that, bro. I made him roommate. Okay, player's roommate. Okay. Oh, he's gonna go back to his apartment. What's gonna happen? Okay, he can lock it and open it and whatever. Wait, what? Bro, um, wait. So does that mean that, wait, I have this floor and I can control this floor as well? Wait a minute. Wait, is that how you get multiple floors in Brookhaven? Okay, I, I didn't expect that. I thought it was gonna be with the houses, but I think the best way to get three floors in Brookhaven, you know, if you have a friend, you can add an extra floor to your Brookhaven house. In a period, this video literally shows us how to add extra floors just like this. Okay, first he goes to house 16 and he gets out this exact house right here. I feel like that, that's pretty easy to do. I really hope I can get extra floors. Because I believe the most floors you can have is like three. Or I guess floor with this one. But this one only has three. Let's see if we can get five floors in Brookhaven. But watching this video right now, come on, come on. Please tell me how to do this. He goes inside the house. He goes inside the house. I guess he's going to go up all the way. And we're going to see at the top what he does. Okay, he's going to add floors again. I exactly know what he's going to do. He's going to go up on top. And he's going to try to add extra floors. Let's see exactly how he does it. By making myself up there. Okay. Is there like a secret button that I can press up here? That adds extra floors? Wait, he's going to his tools. He's going to his tools. Okay, what is he going to do? Wait, there's no way there's a tool that actually adds extra floors to your brick house. Wait, he got a ladder. Oh, he's going to jump up the ladder over there. Okay, that's pretty easy to do. That's pretty easy to do, bro. I'm going to do anything to get extra floors in Brookhaven. All right, put the ladder right here. Now I'm going to go up here. And dude, okay, are there any buttons? But I look super cool up here. You know, I can look at everything. But imagine getting up even more. Imagine the views of the Brookhaven map you can see. Come on, are there any buttons? Okay, there's a furnace right here. But there's a button that I can press and I don't build extra floors. Or it seems like he's on top of the building right now. Come on, come on, come on. Tell me how to add extra floors, bro. This guy just talked to me. Where's he going? Oh, and also just realized, I think he has the Brookhaven Japanese theme. Look at this. The buildings over there that you can see. These are Japanese buildings. We might need to get the theme. Okay, we're gonna go up here. We're gonna go. I think we have to go over here to the theme section. And then you're, you're all gonna see some buildings up here right here, right? So we're gonna, okay, the Japanese theme right here. Okay, we're gonna click on that. And then the buildings are up here. Look at that. Japanese. There's a lot of Japanese things up here. Oh my god, okay, yeah, yeah. But these are really not extra floors, though. Because you can literally go through these buildings. Just like this. Look at this. Come on. I wanna add extra floors to this Brookhaven house over here. If you add extra floors, I will give you 1 million Robux. Wait, oh my god, wait, he's, he's, he's that the real Mr. Beast, bro? Wait, 1 million Robux? Are you serious? Like, imagine the things I can buy with the 1 million Robux, bro? Yes. Bro, okay, we need to add extra floors because of Mr. Beast. Okay, okay he's going to the source. He, he's getting out the props. He's getting out the props. Okay, and now he's, wait, what is he building, huh? Are you sure it's gonna turn into an extra floor? What is he doing? Okay, I don't know. Do it fast. I don't have that much time. I mean, okay, Mr. Beast, I mean, I'm pretty sure he's pretty busy. Okay, we're gonna call the props. Okay, here. We have to do this fast because Mr. Beast is not happy with this, and I need to get that million Robux. I think he had this. Okay, I think he had this, and then he puts him around the house. Okay, I think he did it like this, right? But wait, it's not even placing that correctly. I need to film the last sleep ocean wins one million dollar video, so do it fast. Oh, Mr. Beast needs to film another video again. Oh, look at this. If I zoom in, it actually becomes more straight. So I guess I'm gonna zoom in and I'm gonna do the exact same thing he did. Come on, come on. We have to add extra. Okay, I think this part is kind of finished. Now we gotta do the whole other Bruh. part. That's like this video right here. If you do it faster, you get 10 million Robux. Wait, what? 10? Bro, bro, walk. Okay, 10 million Robux. Okay, I, I, I cannot miss this opportunity, Mr. Beast. Okay, you know what? Wait, I'm gonna go super speed. Come on, come on. Super, super, super Wee. speed. Right oh my god, I just actually fell off. Let's see what, he, what, what happens after he actually does this. I wonder if it turns in to an extra floor. Like, imagine it's like a regular floor. Like a floor like this, but it actually turns into that. Like, that would be crazy. Oh my god, look at this. Does this actually not look like a construction thing? It's slow, faster. I'm sorry, Mr. Beast. I'm sorry. Okay, I guess this is where the window is gonna go. So I'm gonna put like two of these wet windows over here. But how am I gonna do it over here? Oh my god, it's actually working. Okay. Oh my god, we're actually gonna do it. Oh my god, look at this. This actually looks so cool. Okay, let's see what the next step is, dude. I really wanna make this into an extra floor. Okay, next, apparently, he's gonna go to the props and he's gonna use the bed prop. What? And he's gonna wait. What? Oh, he's gonna make like a little room, bro. I really hope this turns out like an extra floor with the, you know, the, the floors like down here, you know, with, with the room like right there. Okay, I don't know if there's a bed prop. Wait a minute. There's like a medic bed prop. All right, I guess I'm gonna create a little room right here with the bed. Okay, let's put the bed prop right here. And apparently, you can also put like gaming chairs. This can be way better than the down here, bro. This is like, this looks like an old computer, bro. Like, you can't even play anything on this thing. Oh, I I mean, you can look at cute dogs and cats stuff. But I really wonder if it can become a floor like this, dude. Like, I, I don't know if this is a new Brookhaven update or something. You know, God, we even got a door prop. Wow. And ooh, look at this. There's a gaming chair. There's even a mic, bro. I can record YouTube videos on this. Wait, and I can click. Oh, yo, you can click and you can play Fortnite, Minecraft, Roblox. You can create Roblox games. You can play some Brookhaven. Bro, okay, this is amazing. But you know what? We're going we're gonna to play Brookhaven because uh, it's the best game. Right? Okay, let's actually see what 
happens, dude? He doesn't even have a door. Okay, I think our floor might be better because we literally have the best door in the game. Well, next we have to add TVs, sofas, and everything. Okay. And yo, he used the furnace to add the TV. Yo, that's smart. So we have a brick here TV right here, bro. Okay, we're gonna put the brick here TV right up the upper top of here. There we go. Look at that TV. And yo, we got that sofa. I mean, I don't know if he should be close, sitting this close to the TV, but like, whatever. We're, we can watch the brick here TV. And yo, we even got a dining table. Oh, we can get like a kitchen right here. Faster. Don't you want that 10 mil robux? Oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want the 10 mil robux. Okay, we're gonna put some food. We're gonna put some on the table so it actually looks like, you know, people are having food and stuff like that. How do, how do I put this on? Wait, can I actually not put these on? Oh, wait, I can put some pizza on here. Um, hello? Bro, I, I cannot put anything on the tables, which sucks. Wait, I can put a safe, bro. Okay, we're gonna put a safe like right here and hopefully it's gonna be protected, all right? Haha. <laughs> let's see what other things this guy does. Dude, there's no way at the end that we don't get a realistic floor, all right? Oh my God, I mean, it's already looking super good right there. How is our looking? Our looking pretty good as well, I'm not gonna lie. And yo, he even created a restroom in the thing. And oh, even the safe. Okay, we need a restroom. We need a restroom right now. Yo, I didn't even know you could literally put a toilet on here. Oh my God, look at this. Yo, we got doors, cabinets, beds. Wait, wait, I didn't even know you could put these. We don't even need a sleeping bag. Okay, put this cool bed on here that you can actually sleep on. And then, oh, this is where like you can keep all the things. You know what, in the room, you're, you're gonna need a place to keep all your things. So I think it could be this. Or you know what, I don't like that too much. I think I think this one looks better, honestly. How about this? Like folders where you can keep your stuff. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. The first option was way, way better. Bro's got a Coke machine in his extra floor. Are you kidding me right now? That's crazy. Oh my God, apparently later in the video, this is gonna show us how to get those extra floors like that, bro. How do you even get that? Bro, that's infinite extra floors. Is that even the real bro? Kevin? Oh wait, we can add a gym room. We can add a gym room. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna add a gym room right here. Okay, I'm gonna add a gym room right here. Okay, that's gonna be pretty good. And we're even gonna add a basketball thing, dude. Yo. Oh, no, they had a PlayStation. Yo, we got a PlayStation, bro. Oh my God, we got two. 10 minutes left. There are no robots. Bro, no, no, no. We have to do something. We have to do something. Okay, uh, pause, 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 pause. Okay, we need to make this cool so it can actually become a floor. Faster. Okay, Mr. Beast. Okay, he literally hit the gym, bro, and he's saying faster. Are you kidding me, Mr. Beast? Make it a roof. Oh, we gotta give it a roof. Oh, wait, look at this. I can use this as roof, bro. Oh my God. Okay, okay. I'm gonna use those as roof. And imagine putting it all over, bro. That literally acts as roof. Oh my God. This is literally gonna be the best floor in Brookhaven. I'm actually gonna be adding floors in Brookhaven. This is crazy. Wait, this one has one, two, three. Wait, you can literally have so many floors, bro. You can literally have 10 floors. Are you kidding bro. me right now? Oh my god, this guy better be for you, alright? There's no way, bro. You can literally add 10 floors in Brookhaven. I didn't even know that. Oh my god, wait, there's another one over there that had a lot of floors as well. I mean, the Japanese theme is pretty good as well, with the amount of floors that you can see. Oh yeah, oh my god, look at this. I'm putting the roofs right now. Okay, this actually looks like a roof right now. Oh my god. Look at this, bro. This actually looks like a roof. Actually, bro, this actually looks like an extra floor. Oh my god, it does. Okay, I think the roof's completely done right now. This is good. And we can literally play basketball. We can literally work out. We can literally have a pool. Okay, I think this is pretty good. We can literally watch TV and play. I still have another trick apparently that he's gonna show us. Literally gonna get you like in like 10 floors in Brookhaven. It's gonna be kind of crazy. I'm not gonna wait. He's fine, bro. Bro, is this fake Brookhaven or real Brookhaven right now, bro? Like, this guy's literally fly, bro. I'm gonna assume this is fake Brookhaven. But apparently, at the end, he's actually gonna show us how to add extra floors as well. Because as you can see, the first method, I mean, I guess it kind of worked. I did it better than him, let's be honest here. Like, I actually had a roof. But then apparently, the next method he's gonna show us is gonna be oh, wait. It's right here, bro. He literally is gonna add extra floors to the Apartment. Oh my god, this is gonna be crazy. Okay, he's gonna get it out and then he's gonna get out. Okay, the skate park. Oh my god, okay, okay, okay. What if I tell Mr. Base? Hey, Mr. Base, I, I found found out how to add extra floors, bro. I need a 10 mil Robux right now, bro. Come on. Hurry up, buddy. Carl called me. Wait, Carl from Mr. Beast, bro? He called him? Okay, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I literally won't let Carl from Mr. Beast steal 10 million Robux from me. All right, all right, I need that 10 million right now. Okay, we're gonna get the skateboard. Okay, skate park, I guess. There we go. And then apparently, the skate park literally has two floors. Oh my god, that's true. It has one floor right here and one floor right there. There, huh? What else is in that video? I wonder what else is in that video. Bimi, what do you think, Bimi? What? what? Bro, he's like, we can literally get extra floors with this. Okay, this is gonna be crazy. We can exercise this. He's gonna get it out. Okay, he got it out. He got it out. He's gonna go inside. Okay, come on, bro. Come on, come on. I want those extra floors right now, bro. Come on. Like, don't, don't scam me with the video, all right? Okay. Next, he's gonna wait. He's up there. Okay. I'm not sure if I can go up there just because, like, we got the Japanese theme, but I guess I'm gonna have to remove the Japanese theme. So there we go. We're gonna remove that Japanese theme. And yo, look at this. Oh my God, we got even what? The skate park's insane. Like, you got like another floor over here. Like the, the the, the third floor is like insanely big. I really love the third floor, but wait. He's gonna get his friend. Oh, okay. He's gonna get his friend and his friend gets out of the house. Okay, since I don't have any friends. So I'm literally gonna use the alt account to do this. So let's join. Right, there we go, my alt bacon boy account. And I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to do what he does. Okay, I'm gonna have to give myself roommate. Hopefully this is gonna be pretty cool to do. All right, bacon boy, let's go. And uh, why is the bacon boy so sad? And then look at this. I'm here with the beamy, bro. Beamy the monkey. Wah, wah. Anyways, okay. I guess I'm gonna get this floor right here. And wait, what if I get the skate park again? I don't, I don't know. I, I feel like it's gonna look cooler. And the next, all 
I need to do is get the shopping cart. Come on, bro. Mr. Mr. Beast better give me that $10 million. So I need to do this as soon as possible. All right. So we're going to pull him up, up right here. And then all we need to do is uh, give myself roommate. And hopefully the thing right here happens. Okay. Oh my God. Okay. I guess there's one, two, three floors right here. But wait. Okay. I, I'll go. There, 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 okay. I'm, I'm, I'm back on my account. Okay. Wait. Is that actually true? Let me actually see. Yo, you technically have five floors because one floor with the grocery, two, three, four. Oh my God. Okay. Or you technically have three or four. That, that's crazy. You can add extra floors to your apartment. I didn't even know that. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you some secret hiding spots inside of houses and apartments. Fresh apartment, I'm going to be showing you secrets in is going to be this apartment right here, the fresh apartment. Like, I usually don't see any YouTuber really talk about secrets inside this, like, apartment. So I'm inside this apartment and I'll be showing you some secrets. The first hiding spot in this apartment is actually going to be inside the kitchen. And what you want to do, you want to go ahead and go to the avatar and you want to turn yourself really, really small like this. And then after that, you want to go ahead and go straight. And then you want to go through the snake like this. And as you can see, I, I'm pretty sure you, you're going to have to go ahead and lay down. Yeah, lay down. And as you can see, you can literally go ahead and hide up here. You can go ahead and hide up here like this, as you can see, and it's it literally gonna be under the sink. And I don't see a lot of YouTubers really talking about this. So the next hiding spot is gonna be inside the room over here. So there's room, like, there's like three beds in this room, which is kind of crazy. Like, I know it's a big room, but like, there's like three beds. But let's go ahead, and the, the next one is gonna be right here at the plant. So you, all you want to do is go through the plant, and as you can see, I, no one can literally see me right now. Look at this. I can't, I can't even see myself. So this plant really hides you well when you're really, really small. And also, if you guys enjoy those secrets, the mission is to go ahead and use Starco Clean wherever you guys are buying Robux or Premium because you enjoy these secrets and I'm pretty sure you guys didn't know about this. So if you didn't know about this, make sure you use Starco Clean. So the next one is going to be right here at the living room. So there's another plant over here at, at the living room right here. And that's another hiding spot you could literally go ahead and go into. And the next one is going to be at the room over here. So And uh, if you want to spy on someone at the uh, at the room, like if you want to spy on someone, you can just go up here. And as you can see, you're barely visible right here. Like I know you're visible a little bit, but like, you're barely visible. And I'm pretty sure no one's going to really notice you when you're here. Like the, the owner of this like house is really not gonna notice you and those are like three secrets i guess four or five secrets that i already showed you guys in this apartment and i don't usually see a lot of youtubers really talking about these secrets the next hiding spot is gonna be inside the penthouse right here and there's actually someone who claimed the penthouse so what i'm gonna be doing is i'm i'm gonna be trying to hide from these people right here okay i don't know i don't know what these people are doing i'm kind of scared right here all right i think i think the jake guy's right here who i think he owns the apartment oh i think those oh i think those two people actually glitched in there without jake actually knowing wait that's actually crazy wait he didn't know but i'm actually been going ahead and glitching into this house and trying to hide from jake so let's go ahead and try to glitch in right here and as you can see i'm in and uh the first one i mean i'm pretty sure you guys know this this is like literally in every single house you can go ahead and basically hide inside the sink and i don't think he saw me you guys you, you guys saw him walk, walk around right i don't i don't think he saw me actually i almost got caught that's the first hiding spot and the second one i think is gonna be right here the second one's gonna be right here at this plant and uh, i'm trying to hide from jake right now so the second one is right here third one hopefully hopefully i don't see jake anywhere person who owns this okay the third one is obviously right here guys and i'm having trouble since i'm like really little right now yeah I'm, I'm just going to there we go there we go so the second one is gonna be right here guys and i don't think anyone can see me right now i don't think jake can see me and i'm hiding perfectly he hasn't banned me and i'm hiding perfectly inside here so that's that's gonna be the third one in the penthouse it's obviously gonna be right here this, this is a big one actually this is a big sink right here which makes it easier and you can also go ahead and lay down so let me, let me just go ahead and try to lay down and there we go you can literally lay down and as you can see no one can literally see you and there is another hiding spot above the safe so above the safe as you can see there's another hiding spot i'm pretty sure there's like those are like the most like prominent ones the, the most important ones inside here now since the jake i actually didn't ban me and i actually hit really well in the penthouse as you can see there's no red box like there's usually a red box if i get banned and there's none in the apartments so since i didn't get banned guys make sure you just go ahead and subscribe to the channel and then like the video right now because i literally showed you guys some hiding spots while i was hiding from the person but let's go ahead and i'll be going ahead and showing you guys another secret inside a house this time so and the first secret i want to show you is that there's probably a secret inside or a secret room or something like that inside the houses that are that have like a red outline so as you can see this house has a red outline this house has a red outline and then also this house has a red outline so all these houses have secret uh, secret rooms inside the houses so like this one i'm pretty sure a lot of you guys know so i'm, I'm not going to be doing this and this one i'm pretty sure like i don't think a lot of you guys know this so i'm going to be actually going ahead and show you guys some secret rooms inside all right so it's really really dark right now and it's really really creepy right especially Especially since we have like this really dark and uh, devil, like I guess you could call it the devil house. And uh, I, I'm a, fl a flashlight right here because like it's kind of dark. So if I choose white, I can literally see everything clearly.
clearly so i'm just gonna choose white just because i want to see everything clearly but i'm gonna show you guys a secret location a secret hiding spot that you can do so literally once you enter the house there's there's some stairs over here and all you want to do is go up these stairs go through this room over here and then all you want to do is go through the secret like i guess room right here and as you can see you're, you're gonna see this you, you want to go through this right here and then you're gonna see the secret room right here with the chair and there's like an agency badge right here which really really creeps me out because the agency does some really really weird things i actually showing you guys what the secret uh what the agency actually might have done back back like a few years ago i guess but as you can see there's a broken window over here as well like there's a broken window and this, this kind of lo looks like witchcraft or something this honestly looks like witchcraft like a broken window the small chairs there's like an x over here uh, like a platform over here and then there's a book also so as you can see there's a book and i don't know what this says it has like a black it's like a black image i think like at the bottom and top uh which is i don't know what, what that is but there's also agency bad. So this is probably what something this is probably related to the agency. And the agency, I'm assuming, is the government. The government is probably the agency. So maybe if I actually go inside the mayor's office, I can actually find something about the agency and actually solve the mystery of the agency or what it is. It might be the government. My theory is it's probably the government. Like no one's actually been doing this. It's probably gonna be the government. And I'm pretty sure there's others as well inside this house. I'm pretty sure there's one. Yeah, there's one right here. As you can see, there's one at the um, closet over here. So there's one at the closet. You can literally hide here. I don't think there's any here. There's obviously gonna be the one. The default one is always gonna be at the sink in any bathroom. Room. and also let's go ahead and see is there is there one on top of here yeah there's one on top here like i literally guessed it right guys look at this there's one on top of the safe right here that's gonna keep on looking yeah, th there's one right here there's one next to like next to the bed over here which is pretty cool like if someone's you know doing something in the bed you can literally go ahead and go over here and uh, let's go ahead and go over here as well oh there's there's oh i think you can go inside here there we go you can literally go inside here this kind of looks like a clock like at first i thought this was a clock but then i'm like okay i don't know what this is like like could this be like a vertical coffin i mean this is kind of creepy guys like a vertical co a coffin inside of brookhaven like what like who even uses vertical coffins but i have no idea what this is but it kind of looks like that and we have room over here uh, can you actually go inside yeah you can go inside these boxes over here which is pretty cool and hide inside here so there's a lot of secrets inside a lot of hiding spots inside this house so if someone has this house guys you can literally go out and hide anywhere you can hide right here you can literally hide right here now in the in this video i actually talked a lot about the agency bad inside the creepy dark house i'm actually gonna showing you guys something really Really creepy about the agency badge or the agency inside of Brookhaven which I assume is the government I'll be showing you guys what the agency might have actually done so I'm gonna be going ahead and I'm gonna be actually pulling out like a ladder so there we go I literally have a ladder right now and once I have a ladder I'm gonna be going up this ladder and we'll be going through this window right here and as you can see there's a big big agency badge over here which is kind of creepy because it's not it's inside this like abandoned room above the hospital this is literally like abandoned room above the hospital and there's an agency badge over here as you, guys, as you guys can see there's literally observation room and a lot of people in the comment section were talking about that this body right here inside the observation room might be the person inside the casket if you guys don't know what the, what the person inside the casket is make sure you guys go ahead and watch my other videos but literally the person inside the casket the picture the person inside the casket might actually be this guy right here which is kind of which is going to be kind of creepy because this guy's like a literal zombie like this guy looks like a zombie or maybe maybe since it's green maybe the developers are like saying that this is like a rotten um rotten person <laughs> inside a uh, brookhaven which is kind of creepy honestly kind of creepy and there's no there's no like cracks or anything like that it's like completely sealed up which means that this guy could be I don't know, <laughs> contagious. Like, this guy could could be contagious and he could be spreading something. But there's also some kind of glue over here, which means that he could be spreading something. But as you can see, there's the observation room and there's also the agency badge right here, which means the agency actually did this. And I also told you guys about this being the government, right? So I'm gonna be going ahead and going over, I'm gonna be going to a place where the government might be. Right, so let's go ahead and go over to the mayor, mayor's office. I, I don't know, I don't know if I can actually find an agency badge inside the mayor's office. Let's go ahead and try to find this. There's picture frames without pictures in them. Look at this. There's picture flames, frames without pictures in them, which is kind of creepy. <laughs> Cause like, why would you have a picture frame if, you do, if you're not gonna put a picture, especially since it's the mayor's office like i would expect some fishers in there kind of wondering if there's actually something inside here but i can't really i can't really get inside here except by doing like shift lock i'm pretty sure yeah except like turning on shift lock and then i can literally let's, let's go there we go shift lock right here I, oh my god what did i just do so let's go ahead and do shift lock and let, let's try to let's try to see if there's anything inside here 
yeah the, the, yeah there seems to be nothing inside here actually as you can see i literally did shift lock let me just turn that off because it's kind of annoying shift lock is kind of annoying for me the, does this computer actually turn on i don't think it does yeah i don't think the computer turns on but i actually have a laptop here so let's go ahead and look at the laptop and see if we can actually find like an agency badge on here screen actually changes and there's a leaf over here i'm gonna press, press f again and okay there's like this red and uh white screen okay there's like another screen over here that pops up which doesn't really have the agency badge or anything i don't know if the government's actually trying to hide something over here but i'm thinking it's probably going to be the government but i really can't find any clues about this can't really find any clues about this inside the mayor's office but this video was supposed to be about like hiding spots inside a brick haven right so i'm literally going ahead so i'm gonna be going ahead and spawning a house just to show you guys another secret inside a brick haven now i'm not going to be spawning a house that has a, like a red thing on it there's actually some houses because there's actually some houses that are, don't have the red outline but they actually have secrets in them like creepy creepy secret and one of the houses is going to be this house right here so it's going to spawn this house and it's like it's like a it's like a cool house honestly like i would actually live in this house in real life <laughs> honestly and it's a pretty big house it's a pretty cool house honestly yeah, i have to tell you guys i would live in this house in real life but once we go up here and we go to the main bedroom the main bedroom right here you want to go ahead and go over to the uh, go over to the closet over here and you want to go ahead and go, keep going forward and as you can see once you keep going forward, you're gonna come ladder, and as you can see, there's some crystals over here. Crystals with hashtag, hashtag, hashtag on it, and then another crystal over here. And this is like literally witchcraft, guys. Like, look at this. This is literally witchcraft. It's really so creepy. It's above this house. It's literally so so creepy, guys. Look at this. There's like, uh, there's like lights over here. There's a crystal. I don't know. I don't even know what this is, honestly. Oh, this, this kind of looks like a person, honestly. Like something that you can hang your clothes on or something like that like in minecraft if you guys ever played minecraft there's like you can place your armor on it and it's like it's like kind of the same thing so i'm guessing this is something like where they can uh, put their like armor or like their like clothes on it like or like military clothes or something like that on this and uh, however there's like lights on it and there's like a crystal on top of it like the where the head's supposed to be which is kind of creepy and there's also like hashtag 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 here and there's a crystal so it's trying to tell us something but like the roblox i guess the roblox system literally like blurs it out <laughs> but as you can see this this is a kind of creepy spot i mean this is a good hiding spot but it's a really really creepy spot and also guys you can go you can if you guys turn small you can basically go ahead and hide in, hide in the spot as, as well no i'm actually going to be going ahead and demonstrating this let's go to turn small and as you can see you can literally go ahead and hide hide here because someone actually hit here when when i had this house guys someone actually hit here and actually spied on me which is kind of creepy <laughs> But hey, they actually hit pretty well, so I couldn't ban them. But and inside this house, this, this one's gotta be the best hiding spot right here, as you can see. This one's gotta be the best hiding spot. Like, look at this. You just go, basically go on and go into the plant, and as you can see, you can basically go inside here. And if you guys learn anything about in this video, I want I want you guys to learn this. You can basically go ahead and hide into any plant. Like in most plants, guys, you get you guys can go ahead and hide. And if you guys are looking for a hiding spot, make sure you guys go ahead and go to the plants. Like, look at this. I can go to the, go to this plant right here. I can hide out here. Like, go to the hiding. Uh, like the one of the best hiding spots inside of Brickhaven houses is gonna be inside the uh, plants all right so as you can see there's literally a uh, like a family i guess they moved in here and they literally got the same house as i did right 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 here right so i'm literally going ahead and going inside this house and i'm actually gonna be trying to hide guys i'm actually gonna do this so let's go ahead and uh, i'm pretty sure you're gonna need the sleeping bag i'm gonna i'm gonna get the sleeping bag and let me just turn really really small and then i'm gonna be spying on this family as you can see i'm gonna be using my my own hiding tricks on this family i see this family over here let's go ahead and we're going this okay oh i'm just going to splat okay oh my god I, hopefully hopefully they didn't see me hopefully they didn't see me okay let, let me just go ahead and go, in, go inside here i'm gonna go inside here and let's see what the family is actually saying can you be my mom and dad okay so i guess the dad's over here oh look at this look he literally didn't see me he literally didn't see me look at this okay I wonder, I wonder what they're gonna say to this person. I wonder what they're gonna say to the kid. Si, pero no hablo inglés. Oh, so she said, yes, I don't speak English. I, I kind of want to make a run for this. Okay, oh, is she actually staring at me? Dude, is she actually staring at me? I just moved too. I just moved. I think she's staring at me. Oh, what? She she disappeared. Wait, she just disappeared. Wait, what? She literally just disappeared. I wonder if we can, wait, can you actually go into it? All right, so I see this house a lot inside of Brookhaven and there, there's actually someone living in it and they have the blinds on. So there's probably something happening inside here. So I kind of want to know. I'm going to be going out and going inside this house and I'm going to be literally showing you guys some secrets, some like hidden, hide, hidden places inside this house. Oh, oh my God, no, 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 oh my God, no, 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 hold on. Hopefully I didn't get banned. Okay, okay, they're, they're coming at me, okay. Oh my God, oh my God, that was kind of, that was kind of, okay. <laughs> That was kind of close right there. But let's go ahead and we're trying to glitch inside this house. And uh, 
you know, I'm, I'm gonna be hiding in a, inside a spot that they probably don't know about. Actually, 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 hold, hold on. I'm gonna be trying to get their attention. I'm gonna be trying to get their attention. And then I'm gonna be going to uh, inside a spot that they don't know about, that they don't, that they probably don't know about, and they, they can't find me ever. So let's go ahead and see what where the family is. So let's go ahead and see, okay. But I'm gonna show you guys a secret sauce. So, so I'm pretty sure you guys know this. It's literally so obvious though. So it's gonna be right here, and you guys can actually go ahead and teleport to this like room over here. And this is really, really obvious. That's why I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on this because like, it's literally so obvious inside this house. But let's go ahead and we're going up here. And I'm pretty sure the family's up here, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Let's go ahead and see. Where is the family? Or did they just leave the house? Oh my god, look at this. The whole Brookhaven map is literally underwater right now. Well, I want to show you guys something very, very crazy. The whole Brookhaven map is going to be flooded very, very soon. And I want to show you guys how this is actually going to be happening. But before we begin, make sure you guys go ahead and use Starco Clean whenever you guys are buying Robux or Premium because that's going to help me out a lot. I'm going to be showing you guys what's happening to Brookhaven and how it's actually going to be flooded, which is just going to be crazy. Like, imagine the whole Brookhaven map being flooded. And I'll be showing you guys some clues as to why this might actually be happening. Recently, I just saw a TikTok video on my like for you page, right? So if you guys use TikTok, you guys know what a for you page is, right? So my for you page, I literally saw this video about someone literally going into Brookhaven and then turning the whole map flooded by using a couple of tricks that I'm gonna show you guys in this video. So if we make our way towards the hospital right here, right? So the hospital is literally next to the police station. And once you make your way to the hospital, here's what you here's where you want to go. So you guys want to enter and then you want to go ahead and go over to this x-ray uh, x-ray, I guess, uh, room. You want to go behind this and you want to just go keep going forward now as you can see you're literally gonna be you can literally go through this wall over here and once you go keep going forward you can see this over here so you can see like a chair over here and then you can see a desk and then you can see like a i guess papers over here it, it seems like a pretty creepy room right and there's only like one light bulb over there so once you guys are in this room you guys can obviously read this letter and stuff let me actually go ahead and get on my flashlight because that's gonna help it says report everyone said this time would be different nevertheless history did repeat itself i cannot put, pinpoint the power source however it looks to be beyond this world maybe history will show us the way and that's literally the report and it says operation what's that red river terminated so you guys write that right it says operation red river a river has water right so this is literally hinting towards water which could mean that the whole map is getting flooded but also it says in this letter it says i cannot pinpoint the power source power source so power source i'm, I'm guessing something that could flood the whole map but especially reading the after reading the letter, this creeps me out a lot and it makes me believe that the whole map is actually gonna be getting flooded. Basically, I want to show you guys something in this room that actually hints towards this. So what you want to do right here, once you're at the table, right? Or once you're at the table over here, you want to go ahead and you angle your camera down just like I'm doing right now, and you guys can see something under over here. You guys can see this blue thing over here, right? And once you click on the blue thing, let me let me just click on the blue thing. And as you can see, once you literally click on the blue thing, you're gonna be teleported to over here, where it's just, I guess it's like a swimming pool, and then it has an agency badge over here. And uh, my theory is that this could be the government, right? The and A government agency. And also it says right here, it says this coordination, I don't know what that coordination is. And then it says declination offline, power offline. So I think that the letter was pointing out to this over here, this like, I guess, water thing over here, like a swimming pool over here. And that button that, the, I guess the power source, I guess the power source was, was like the button. So it literally says power offline. And I don't know when it's gonna go online. I think if it goes online, I'm pretty sure the whole map is gonna be getting flooded, which is just gonna be crazy. But as you can see, there's agency bad. And if you guys want to see what, what these like rooms are, it's just like basically like, I don't know. It's just, it's just a room with like a table over here. I don't even know what these, what these rooms are. Honestly, let's go ahead and go to another room over here. Let's go into this room. It's just another table with a different one. There's some windows. So is this something that, that got flooded or something? There's, there, there, there's like windows, there's a table. So I have no idea what this is, but as you can see, and there's also a table over here. So these rooms seem to be like the same, but like some have different windows. Some have like, some have the table at a different spot. See, this has one window. We already saw some, someone, uh, some of them have, might be at the secret location. If you go into the police station, right? And then you go ahead and go into one of the cells and you jump on the bed and you go through the uh, vent, right? So let me just go to the, go to the vent. I'm having, so, oh my God, I'm having so much trouble. Let's go ahead and see. There we go, I think I went in, there we go. So you go through the vent, and then you just, what you wanna do is you wanna go forward, keep going forward, 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 and then 
you're eventually going to go through like a wall, I guess. You're eventually going to go through a wall and then you're going to eventually go through the secret room over here. And then you're and then what you want to do is you want to go over here and then you angle your camera until you see the blue a blue thing over here and you click on it and you're going to get a card over there. Right? So I want to go ahead and go to the power source and see what what this actually does. Like what this all actually means. So I'm going to go ahead and spawn this Lamborghini and we've been going there right now. And if you guys are wondering where it is, it's basically towards this area right now. So uh, here's the hospital and here's the school, right? So it's towards this area over here and here's like the lake house where you can buy the lake house and stuff. And then all you want to do, I'm pretty sure is turn left and then you're going to see the power source like the solar panels and then you're gonna see the power source. there we go i literally see the power sources over here uh let me just go ahead and back up and i'll be showing you guys something crazy over here so let's go ahead we're going over here boom there we go and then we are at the we are at the station where you can basically control the power so i wonder what this says over here it says brookhaven electric right brookhaven electric let's go ahead and pull out our card and go through this and it says temperature stable and then it has off over here. At the beginning of the video, right, you guys saw that it said off, right? Like the power off, right? Offline, I think. Uh, at the hospital, you guys saw that it says power offline, right? Now here, it's, it's red, which means it's probably offline. So I wonder if I turn this on, that if, it, if it's gonna go online. Like, I wonder if that's true. So I'm literally be going ahead and going over here. And then I'm gonna type in the password because you have to type in the password. So the password is gonna be your username if you guys wanna do this as well. So I just should type in my password. And then we're going over here and then I'm gonna be clicking on this. And then it's, it says, okay, it went on and the temperature is still stable, which is pretty cool. And I'm pretty sure that, I'm pretty sure I turned it on right there. So let's see, once I turn it on, let's go back to the hospital and actually see if anything has happened. If you guys are enjoying the video so far, make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to the channel and then also like this video if you guys like seeing Brookhaven secrets. But let's go ahead and I'm gonna be going to the same thing that I showed you guys at the beginning of the video. I'm gonna go behind here and then go through this wall, go over here, and then I'm gonna be going ahead and positioning my camera, a camera under the table and click on this and let's see what this is. Wait, it still says offline. It still says offline and it says gravitational time dilation unavailable. So it literally said that there was, wait, at the beginning of the video guys, it literally gave us coordinates, right? But now it says gravitational time dilation unavailable power offline. So it, says power, uh, it still says power offline. So I wonder if when the power goes online, oh, there we go. Oh, it actually shows us the, uh, uh, the coordinate over there. That's crazy. Okay. I guess it changes every single time, but it still says power offline, which makes me believe that once it goes online, it's literally going to be flooding the whole Brookhaven map, guys. Oh my God. Now, let me know in the comment section down below, guys. Would you guys like the Brookhaven map to be flooded? Like flooded, like it's probably getting flooded like this right here, probably like with this water. Let me know in the comment section down below, guys. Would, would, would you like Brookhaven being flooded or not? Because this is how the map looks like right now. As you can see, this is literally how the map looks like. I'm, I'm going to turn on my uh, graphics all the way and show you guys. So this is how the map looks like right now, right? And imagine this whole map just being flooded, guys. I guess I'm going to be swimming around and stuff, but that's, that's going to be crazy, honestly. The whole map being flooded and i want to show you guys how it's actually gonna be looking like now i guess we already have like floods inside of brookhaven whenever it rains there's always like a flood kind of but imagine like the whole map actually being like flooded forever though not forever but like for like a long period of time like let's say like like two months or something like that that's gonna be crazy honestly and i wonder if they can actually go ahead and get boats inside of brookhaven that'll be that'll be kind of cool like if they can actually get boats i mean i'm pretty sure we already have like a lake right so boats would would be like a, a very very cool thing all right guys so i want to show you guys something i found on a tiktok and it and it might actually work so we can actually go ahead and flood this entire map right now by just using this but the, in the tiktok it actually worked now many things on tiktok like actually don't work but let's see if this uh, this one actually works. So what the person said was to go ahead and go to the school. So I'm, I'm, I'm at the school right now, right? So go to the school and then we have to go over to the cafeteria. There we go. We have to go over to the cafeteria over here, the lighting room, the cafeteria. And then w once we're at the cafeteria, we have to go ahead and go over here into the theaters. And then let me just go through this. And then we have to go behind here and we have to go up these ladder. I don't know. I don't know what this um, TikToker is really doing, but like the person who made this TikTok literally says that we got to go over here and then we have to go over here and then we have to go to our vehicles and we have to choose uh, this cycle over here. Okay. I just choose a cycle and then we have to go over here and then, okay. And then we have to get out of the ladder. Okay. Let's go ahead and get out of the ladder. I'm pretty sure the ladder is going to be somewhere around here. There we go. There we go. Ladder. And then we have to put the ladder over here, okay? And we have to jump on the ladder. 
Okay, let's jump on the ladder. We have to go through this. Okay, let's go. I went through this. Okay. That's what the TikToker said. And what are we supposed to do? Okay, we have to go over here. And just click on this injection. So we literally have this in our hand. And then we have to click on E get, to get rid of the... And then we have to click on F, F three times. Okay, F, F, F. There we go. Three times. And then we have to go on the share. And then click on the houses. Click on the binoculars. And click on go. It says unable to perform action, and that's totally okay. Okay, and let's see. And we have to reset our character. Okay, let's see. Wait, what? Is the whole map actually underwater? Oh my god. Oh my god, the whole map is underwater, guys. What is this? Yo, the whole map is underwater. That's crazy. I'm at the abandoned house right now, and let's see what kind of secrets we can find. Go behind here. Wait, 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 what is that? Before the video starts, make sure to use Starco Clean wherever you guys are buying Robux or Premium. But I want to show you guys a scary secret about the abandoned house inside of Brookhaven, and it just got updated. So just a few days ago, the brand new apartments came out inside of Brookhaven, right? And in that update, the abandoned house also got updated. And it's really, really scary, guys. It, it seems like a pretty innocent update, right? Innocent update, it's a pretty cool update. Update. I really like it as well. People could just go go ahead and go into the, uh, go inside the apartments, uh, get a penthouse. I think the penthouse looks pretty pretty cool. What you guys don't know is there's new things added about the abandoned house and very very scary secrets that I want to show you guys right now. So the first secret I'm gonna be showing you guys is gonna be located right behind the brand new apartments. And I don't know if this is coincidence, maybe it could be, but. Literally, I'm going to be showing you guys this right now. So behind the apartments, there is the church over here, right? So behind the apartments, there's a church. And inside the church, I'm going to be showing you guys a secret about the abandoned house. So inside this church, once you guys go inside the church, here's what you guys want to do. So you guys want to go over here. And then if you click on the funerals over here, right? You're going to get a casket over here. And, it, and it says enter name, right? So once you go ahead and go inside the casket, right? And then you zoom in, zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. And then you angle your camera. You can see an old picture. Look at this. You can see a black and white picture, and you can see the abandoned house in the background. You can see this man, and you can also see a horse. And this is, this is really creepy, honestly, because it's, it's an old photo, and it's on a casket that's made for funerals. That's that's pretty creepy. Like It's really creepy since it's inside a casket, right? And it's also kind of an old photo. So I guess this is how the abandoned house looked like before it got ruined up, it got abandoned. And I guess this person was living inside the house. I have, I have like, there, there's some good reason to think that he's dead, right? Because it's on a casket, it's in the funerals, it's, it's in the, it's, it's for funerals, it's for a casket, right? So he could be dead. So I guess that hints to him being dead. And um, there's also a horse. So this seems like it's like a, kind of a kind of an old era, I guess. Like before there were cars in Brookhaven, before there was anything else in Brookhaven, there was a horse. And also the photo looks like like a black and like a very old photo, right? So this all hints to this being in the past, the past Brookhaven. But let me know what you what you guys think of the photo. I I I I don't know what I think of the photo, honestly. There's there's a lot of theories you guys can do about the photos, right? And I also want to show you guys something else. So once you guys go ahead and go over here, you guys can choose any houses, right? So uh, I'm at a vacant place right here and you guys can choose any house you guys want. But if you guys choose this one house, I'm going to show you guys right now. So this, this house right here, if you guys choose this house and you guys spawn it. Now this house right here looks the same as the abandoned house. And the, the, the similarities between this house and the abandoned house are very, very shocking. And especially after seeing the video, the photo that I just showed you guys, I think that this house, this house is literally how the house looked like before it got abandoned. Let's go ahead and we're going to the abandoned house. And I want to see if anything has changed inside the abandoned house. So literally, I'm at the abandoned house right here, as you guys can see. And I want to see if anything has changed inside the abandoned house now let's go ahead and see this so the stairs look this look about the same they look about the same right the stairs look about the same and look, let's look at the roof yeah the roof is kind of broken up over here all right so as you guys can see i just pulled up a video and this video was uploaded on march 1st 2021 and i want to compare this uh, how the abandoned look, house looks like in this video to the one that's literally currently right now so as you can see the abandoned house take take a close, take a close look at this right so it's pretty dark right now right and look at the windows look at all this and we'll be going back and seeing if there are any changes made to the as you can see i'm back at the game right now and just like in the video it's morning right now and the abandoned house looks abnormally bright it wasn't this bright in the video and it looks really really bright 
And as you guys can see, there's a literal light up here. As you guys can see, the, the abandoned house is literally changing and we have a light up. And as you can see, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play the video even. And as you can see, it's not as bright as it is, it is right now, even though, it's, uh, in, even though it's in the morning. And there's no light. There's no, I don't think there was, there was like a light bulb or anything like that. But now there is. And I wanna rewind a little bit as well because I think this position is pretty good. So as you can see, we're at the house right now, right? and right here this window if you guys took, take a look at the took a look at the video i, I want to show you guys the video again so if you guys take a look at this video right here take a close look at this window right here there's nothing there it's just an abandoned window right it's just a broken up window so and then once you look at the window right now inside the abandoned house i don't know if this is hinting to the abandoned house uh being repaired or something like that but that's kind of creepy that this is happening right here i mean out of nowhere out of nowhere there's like a little bit over here so th those are like literally two changes made to the abandoned house and this is not the only one only secret that just got added inside of brookhaven about the abandoned house now i want to show you guys something else so if you go straight towards the farms over here here, right if you go straight towards the farms and if you go to the uh brookhaven staples over here right the brookhaven staples is literally where you get horses right and there was literally a horse inside the picture that you guys saw in, in the casket right so there was a horse inside the casket that you guys just saw and here's the staples where the horses are so i'm pretty sure he was working somewhere around here like the person was working somewhere around here the the, the farmer i don't know he kind of looked like a farmer in my opinion he kind of looked like a farmer so I'm pretty sure he was working somewhere around here. So, so I want to see if I can find some secrets about him in, in like near here, right? So he was a farmer. There's a barn over here. So this is this is totally like a farm, right? And I want to see what kind of secrets are here. So I'm gonna go inside the barn and try to see, try to find some secrets right here about the old man, right? So let's go ahead and see this. So I don't think there's any secrets over here. I'm not sure. Let's go look behind. No, there's none over here. There's some just some haystacks over here. None over here as well. So let's go ahead and we'll be going up the ladder and seeing if there are any any over here. So there's a haystack over here. Haystack over here. Nothing behind over here. Haystack, haystack. There's a light. Uh, the haystack. Okay. Let's see if we can find any pictures. Let's see. I don't. I don't think there's anything over here. Uh, yeah. There's nothing over here. So I think we're gonna we're gonna have to go to the staples because the staples they have more rooms. I'm pretty sure there's more secrets inside there. Let's go and go over there, and I really want to find find solve the mystery of the abandoned house inside of Brookhaven. So let's go and do this right now. So let's go and see. There's some water over here. All right. Let's go and go inside here inside the staples. Is there anything over here? I don't think so. Let's go and look above. Okay. I don't think there's nothing over here. Yeah. I don't think there's anything. Let, let's go behind this, actually. Let's go behind this and see if there's anything else. No, there's nothing over here. Yeah, I don't see anything else. Right now, we're at the hospital over here, right? Let's go ahead and be uh, pulling out my ladder. And we'll be going ahead and putting the ladder up over here. And then we're going to be trying to get up get up here. So I'm going to try to get up there. There we go. And then I'm going to go go over here. And let's see if I can find any secrets over here. So there's an experimental over here. Okay. Uh, there's... There's some glue. I have no idea what that is. Okay. Okay. There's an agency badge over here. That's that's pretty creepy. I guess, I guess there's an FBI in here. I'm not sure. Some kind of agency inside here using this room and it's just abandoned it from the olden days, right? Observation room. So it seems like it seems like like something that an agency would something that the government would, government would do, right? So this seems like something that the government would do since it, since there's an observation room over here. And I don't know who this is. This might be a prisoner. Who knows, right? Who just, who who is being tested over here? Okay. There's some cupboards. There's a bed. There's a where? What is this? There's an agency bed. So I'm pretty sure this is the government. I'm pretty sure this is the government. Okay. There's a surgery room. Oh, oh. There, look at this. We can literally pick this up. Okay. Let's go ahead and see another secret, guys. So I want to show you guys another secret inside the inside the hospital. So that that was the first secret inside the hospital. I want to I'm gonna show you guys a nice second secret. So there's another secret I'm pretty sure somewhere around here. Uh, I, I think it's at the X-ray room. Yeah. So you guys want to go ahead and go over to the X-ray room if you guys want to do this. And then you want to go ahead and go. You guys see this board over here, right? With the skeleton on it. You want to go jump behind this board, and then you want to. I think you gotta go straight like this. How's it get? To, yeah. You got. You guys want to go straight like this, and how's you guys can see? You guys are gonna see this right here. I'm gonna get my get off my binoculars because it's gonna be really really hard to read this. So let me just go ahead and get my binoculars. There we go. And then I want to show you guys what this says. So it says report 
Everyone said this time would be different. Nevertheless, history did repeat itself. I cannot pinpoint the power source. However, it looks to be beyond, beyond this world. Maybe history will show us the way. History. So I see history being pointed out a lot. So there, So look at this. So in the first sentence, you literally see history right there. And then, so we have two, like, the history repeats. Look at this. History repeats itself right there. There's two words, history, right? The, uh, his, uh. So the word history literally repeated itself over here, which means that the, that this person's emphasizing something about history. And as we saw in the casket, it was, I think, I think it was in the history, right? It was in the history. It was literally in the history. And this is pointing out the history. And, but let's go, let's go ahead and see this. Operation Red River terminated. Oh. Seems like this was a report and it just got terminated. Wait, did something? Wait, did the government do something to the man in the in the abandoned house that was just living in the abandoned house? Which is, did they take him to the observation room and do things to him? Yeah, that's kind of creepy. I hope I hope the government really didn't do anything. To I'm gonna be showing you every single secret inside of Brookhaven. So I'm literally be going ahead and going to the apartments and showing you guys some secrets inside the apartments. Now, if you guys like playing Brookhaven, make sure you guys go ahead and leave a like on this video right now. I've claimed this apartment over here, this luxury apartment over here, and I'm literally be showing you guys what's inside here and all the secrets inside here. And also, guys, I'm gonna be showing you every single secret. Not only did these ones, I'm gonna be showing you every single secret. You watch it until the very end, and then literally tell me how many secrets you knew inside the video. So, so when you click on the house, right? Right? So I think it's like the third house that you the, the third apartment that you can get once you once you click on like the vacant sign I guess there's like a big flat TV over here, which is really cool There's couches over here and stuff there. There's some tables over here But I'll be showing you guys a secret right now Let's go ahead and I will show you guys a secret. So you guys want to go ahead and go walk up these uh, walk walk up over here And then once you're right here, you want to go ahead and go inside the bathroom over here and then in the bathroom, guys, oh yeah, I, I really like the bathroom, like the shower especially. Like, the shower looks pretty, pretty cool. Like, it looks so luxury, luxurious. But literally, I'm gonna be showing you guys something. So, right here at the sink over here, right? So once you guys jump at the sink, as you guys can see, you guys can literally go ahead and hide over here. Like, make, you, make, make yourself small. So let me just make myself small. And I'm pretty sure I'm like, I'm gonna be like, they can't even see me. Like, no one can literally see me because I'm so small. Like, look at this. I'm so small, like, they can't even see me. So, you guys can literally go ahead and hide here on top of the sink. And that's literally the first secret in this apartment. And let's go ahead and let me show you guys the second secret. The second secret is going to be like literally inside this apartment as well. And then what you want to do right here, you want to go ahead and you want to go through the wall over here. So let's go and go through the wall. And as you can see, there's literally like a secret, uh, secret way where you can literally hide over here. And I'm pretty sure it's like next to the vault. Like look at the vault right there. So the vault's right there. So you can literally go ahead and go over here if you're breaking it, breaking into like an apartment, right? And then just hide over here until so, until they go away. And you can basically go ahead and just rob the safe. So literally, this, this is a pretty cool one. Uh, I really like the secret, honestly, because it makes it makes robbing the safe really easy. But let's go ahead and be showing you guys even more secrets in this house. So we have our we have um, some clothes over here, bed over here. And then we have lights. Okay, we have a kitchen over here, a computer. Pretty cool, pretty normal stuff, right? Inside Brookhaven. Let's see if I can really see anything. Let's see. I, I don't think this is a secret. It's just, you know, just like a pole over here. But um, I mean, I, I think those ones are like the, uh, the, the the secrets I showed you guys. Like those ones are like the best secret. I'm giving away 1,000 Robux and it can literally give you guys every single game pass. Like you guys can literally buy any game pass inside of Brookhaven with 1,000 Robux, guys. So literally, if you guys want to end the giveaway, all you guys have to do is leave a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and then comment down below about your name. But let's go ahead and literally show you guys the next secrets. So the next secret is going to be in the penthouse over here, right? So in the penthouse, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and let's go ahead and uh, I'm actually trying to glitch in here because it's locked over here so i'm gonna be trying to glitch in here which i probably shouldn't be doing but hey let's go and do this J just because i want to show you guys these secrets so literally look at this this is a brand new penthouse and it looks really really cool look at this really really cool guys so look at this there's um there's some table over here i think this, this is the same one yeah this is the same one i showed you guys uh now this is a secret that i don't see like most youtubers talking about and it's gonna be the secret i'm about to show you guys right now so let's go ahead and go over here and it's really like it's a creepy secret by the way so um i wouldn't recommend going here like at night at 3 a.m or something but let's go ahead and you got you guys need to turn left at this intersection over here i guess at this um at the brooks brooks diner right so you guys want to turn left and you, you want to go ahead and go over straight you want to go straight there's like the hell uh there's the uh, airport over there as well so if you guys like you know want to know the location and we're going on and going on straight and then as you can see this is like 
a creepy house. It's all broken down. It's like abandoned, I guess, a abandoned house right here. And um, it's all broken down. And I don't see a lot of YouTubers really talking about the secret. Like they talk about every single other secret, right? But they don't talk about this one. And it's a pretty creepy secret. And as you can see, there's like a, there's like a crack over here. So this, this, this house, obviously you can't live in this house, right? And I don't know if they're gonna be updating this house or what's gonna be happening, but it's a pretty creepy house not gonna lie like i don't know what happens here at night honestly but i guess it's a pretty creepy house that's all i can say so do you want to click on this right you want to click on uh you, you want to click on the thumbs up button if a house has like a red outline like this right it means that there's a secret inside the house so this one has a red outline right here this um this like i guess demon house has a red outline over here and then this like bunker house has a red, red outline over there so there's like three houses uh, full filled with secrets. Let's go ahead and go with the most recent one So this is the most recent like house that has been added to Brookhaven and the most recent secret So let's go ahead and build this up I mean, this is, I'm honestly this is like one of my favorite houses inside of Brookhaven like they, they have a pool over here and it looks really really luxurious and it looks pretty cool honestly this is a really cool house so once you're in the house you want to go ahead and go over to these stairs over here you want to go in the basement and once you're in the basement or i guess this library right once you're in the library what you want to do is you want to go over here and then i'm pretty sure there's going to be a button somewhere over here so there's a button literally right here guys so there's a literal button over here let me let me just let me just uh put the to uh, torch over here let's see there's a literal button over there right see so which one do you want to go ahead and click on the button and once you guys click, let me, let me just unequip this. Let me just click on the button. And as you can see, the library opens up and you guys can enter this secret room. Literally, you got secret room, which is a pretty cool room right here. Where you got, I guess there's like a secret meeting room over, or something like that. Because there's some chairs over here. There's like, a, I guess, the boss meter or like the leader of the meeting. And as you can see, there's literally people who can sit over here and have a secret meeting under the house. And I'm pretty sure it's going to be like filled with rich people, right? Since it's like a rich house. So it's a pretty, pretty cool secret right here. Um, honestly, you guys can show these to your friends and stuff. For the next secret, again, you're gonna have to go ahead and go into any vacant place, and then you can go ahead and click on it, click thumbs up, and then you can literally go ahead and choose this next house. So next time, next secret I'm gonna show you guys is gonna be in this house right here. If the world's about to end, this is literally the house you guys are gonna need to go into. So yeah, it's a pretty cool house. As you can see, if, if you have no electricity, you can literally go ahead and use the sun for it. And if, if there's something bad happening, if the world's gonna end soon, then this is literally the house you guys are gonna need to get into. But let's Let's go ahead and go inside here and i'll be showing you the secret right now and let, let me see I, i'm pretty sure you can open this up right i, I haven't i haven't tried to open this up i'm sorry guys but i'm pretty sure you can open this up but i don't know how you can but let me see oh there we go i just opened it up as you can see i literally opened it up i it's not this is really not a secret it's, it's supposed to be like very very obvious so the secret inside this house is going to be located at the tv over here so let's go and go over the tv and once you're at the TV over here, you want to go ahead and go over here like this and you guys are going to see this pink button over here. So you want to click on the pink button and as you can see, you're going to get dropped over here and there's a bunch of money over here. There's a bunch of gold over here and there's a bunch of explosives, weapons and stuff like that. Like there's a bunch of like it's a pretty cool place. I'm pretty sure this is where every uh, this is where the owner of this house keeps everything he has. So if the world's about to end, you, you, you want to protect yourself, right? So you want to get some weapons, you want to get some explosives and you also want to keep some cash and some gold yeah, especially some gold since gold is gonna retain the value of your money and there we go that, that that's like literally the first secret inside this house i'm pretty sure there's another secret inside this house i'm, I'm not sure though all right so in the same house right you want to go ahead and go into this like the second shower over here so you want to go to the second like i guess the second bathroom over here and then once you're the second bathroom what you want to do is you want to go over here at the shower and then you want to go on and go straight like this and as you can see you can literally go ahead and if you're breaking into someone else's house right you can literally go ahead and hide over here and then they won't know you're in the house literally you they won't know you're in the house because they're literally like this is such a good hiding spot inside this house pretty cool there's a lot of hiding spots in the brookhaven guys like you guys can literally take, go ahead and take advantage of them and break into people's houses and just stay like you know spy on them or something i don't really know but you guys can literally do that if you guys want. All right, so for the next secret, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go over to the police station over here. Let's go ahead and go over to the police station. And once you, you're at the police station, you want to go ahead and you want to go into any of the cells. Like, uh, there's only like two cells over here. So any one of these cells, I'm going to be going on this one because it's the easiest one to go into. It's the closest one for me. But let's go ahead and be going ahead and then... So once you're in the cell, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go ahead and get on top of this bed over here. Get on top of the top bed. 
and then you want to go ahead and go through this event over here there we go i jumped through that event and then what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go keep going forward like this keep going forward forward and then you guys are going to go ahead and go into the secret room over here and also pro tip make sure you guys go ahead and get a torch and as you can see there's literally a room inside here if you guys didn't know but as you can see literally there's a secret room over here now in the secret room what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go over to this like like this right and then you want to turn your camera right like this and then you guys are going to see a blue thing a blue like a card somewhere around here let's get there we go there's like a blue thing over there right what you want to do is you want to go ahead and click on the blue thing and as you can see you're literally going to get a card and this card is going to be used at this location i'm about to show you guys right now let's go ahead and be exiting out, exiting out the same way so you guys can go ahead and exit out the same way and there we go and then we can go ahead and finally get out and then what you want to do is you want to basically go ahead and just spawn a car right and then you, you want to go to this location over here so what you want to do i think it's i think the location is going to be over in this direction so you want to go ahead and go to this direction i'm going right now let's go ahead and turn okay let me let me just make this faster so it's actually going to be this way guys so you guys want to go ahead and you, want, you guys want to obviously from the main brookhaven street you guys want to go ahead and go straight like this towards the lake house if you guys don't know what it, what the lake house is it's basically like a house at the lake uh in brookhaven so let's go ahead and go over the brookhaven lake there we go so literally at the brookhaven lake right here and then what you want to do you want to turn left and then you're going to see the solar panels and here's the trick so let's go ahead and go to the solar panels over here so some clean energy guys clean energy let's go ahead and go over here we're going ahead and going over here and then as you can see you're gonna need a key card in order to get inside here right so you, you can't use like the bank key card or you can't even use like i guess these, these are the credit cards you guys can use this you can't you can't use these either so you have to use the special card that, that's only found in the police station just like i showed you guys so what you want is you want to go on and go inside here so once you use the card you can literally go on and go inside here as you can see so once you're inside here um you, you can't really turn off anything right yet because you're going to need to go ahead and enter a password and the password is going to be your roblox username and it's ca case sensitive as well so if you have a roblox username if you if you have a roblox username like this right then um make sure you guys type it like that but my roblox username i have a capital c and then also have a capital b so that's what that's what that's what I'm gonna type. So the password is literally gonna be your Roblox username. So my Roblox username is Cleansebeam, right? So I'm literally typing that in, enter, and there we go. Password approved. And then I can literally go ahead and turn this on. I guess turn turn this on and off. As you can see, I'm, I'm just gonna turn it on since it was, since it was off. And there we go. Literally, that's that's what you can do. And it's a pretty cool secret actually. Like this is one of the, I guess this is one of the most common secrets. But I'm gonna show you guys some other secret as well over here. We're going to be going to the spawn, as you can see. And from the spawn, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go straight like this towards this area, towards the police station and towards the fire station over here. And then you're going to see the auto shop over here. So once you're at the auto shop, here's what you want to do. You want to go ahead and go inside the auto shop. You want to go inside the parts over here and you want to click on this broom over here. And as you can see, this door opens up and you can drop down and as you can see there's like a literal secret layer over here like i guess a criminal uh room over here like this is like an upgraded one like the, there's another one that was um the there's like another one in brookhaven but this is like the most like modern one this is like the cleanest one honestly like this, this is a pretty good thing there's like hacking stuff for over here so you have two computers which you can hack from if you're a criminal i guess in brookhaven if you're pretending to be a criminal and um, there's also like a bank camera over here, and then there's a police camera. I don't know how I don't know how they fit in the cameras over there, which is, I guess, pretty cool. They're pretty smart, I guess. And then also, I'm pretty sure that's like a yeah. So that's I mean, this is a pretty cool thing, you know, if you're a criminal. There's a brand new secret inside of Brookhaven that you probably don't know. I'll be telling you that secret right now because it just got added in the brand new apartments update, and it's inside the grocery store. But before we begin, make sure you start real clean. Remember, you're buying Robux or premium. I think this is a brand new door or maybe it was here before but I have no clue but after that let's go ahead and go behind this and we can literally go ahead and go up here so once we go up here we can go to the church over here and inside the church I already showed you guys this but however there's a brand new secret that actually happened inside the church so literally once you once you're at the church you can go ahead and click on the funerals and then you can enter here and I'm pretty sure most of you guys know this if you, if you go ahead and go to the funerals and you go in and then you just zoom in and you have the perfect camera angle or like you just move your camera like this you can see a picture of an old man a horse and also some houses that are here and something actually got updated about this and the whole storyline actually changed which is pretty cool 
So uh, as you can see, just take a look at the picture, take a look at the man, and we've been going ahead and going over to another location where it has a picture on it. And if you want to know where the location is, I'll be taking you, taking you there right now. So here is the church right here. So I'm gonna go down like this, and then I'm gonna turn like left, I guess, right over here. And then we'll be going over to this place over here. So I'll be trying to get the place right now. So it's gonna be the police station right here. And I've showed the secret in like another video, in like, in like the video where I show you guys every single secret about Brookhaven. So literally it's gonna be up here to the event and then all you have to do is keep going forward and then you can go into a room so there we go I, I got a torch right now and then we'll be going to, uh we're at the room right here right and obviously you can go up to this go up to this right here and then you could turn your and you could basically go ahead and click on the blue color and then you're gonna get a card over here right however right in this room you can see a light over here right okay hold on let me just go ahead and quit my job there we go and you can see a light up here i want you to take a look at this light because it's gonna make sense towards the end of the video because there's something creepy about this light but as you can see right here there is a picture of a, a like i guess a swap guy right here but he has a casket and inside the casket there was a picture about this man right so a lot of people are saying that this uh, this guy right here the swap guy he is the son of the guy who is in the casket it actually makes a lot of sense since this person right here could be the son of the uh, person who's in the abandoned house who was in the abandoned house i guess i guess you could say he lived in the abandoned house back in the days back in like back when there were horses and plus compared to the picture the picture looked black and white right it, it was it wasn't a, a color picture but this picture right here is colored and i guess the brookhaven developers are really giving us clues right here so there's a picture over here and there's also a picture at the funeral so i think the brookhaven developers are giving us a clue that this guy could be the son of him and i i'm i'm really excited for the story guys like i don't know where the next where this story is gonna actually go like this guy's the son and uh, there's a lot a lot of secrets inside brookhaven that are really Really, really creepy however i'm actually kind of excited for this now if you are enjoying this video so far make sure to go ahead and subscribe to the channel and then also leave a like on this video if you like playing brookhaven and all the secrets brookhaven has because like i i kind of like all the secrets brookhaven has we're gonna be going over to the infamous abandoned house right here as you can see the infamous abandoned house and i told you guys to like look carefully at the room that was on top of the police station right we're gonna be going inside the abandoned house and as you can see there's a light over here and this light is the same light that, that, that was there inside the room as well and honestly though these two places this place right here right the, the abandoned house and also the place above the police station right they both look very very creepy and they all, both have the similar kind of light right here so they both could be telling us something about this like the person right here i guess the, the person who was living right here who's the father of the fbi person right maybe they're meeting each other we, we can assume that they're probably meeting each other right because since it, they have the same light and by the way guys by the way this light wasn't here before like like this light was not here before. So as you can see, I pulled up a Brookhaven video on YouTube and this was uploaded on March 1st, 2021. And this is a Brookhaven abandoned house back in March 2021. And as you can see, this is at like, in the morning right as you can see there's in the, this is in the morning and the abandoned house looks very very dark and as you can see it looks very very dark and there's no light on top of here the abandoned house right now is very very bright and it's right night right now look, look at this this is night and i don't have any torch right here and let me just turn off actually let me just go ahead and turn off my lights over here i'm gonna turn off my lights there we go i literally turn off my lights as well and as you can see the abandoned house is very very bright and it's night right now in the video it was morning so it shouldn't be this bright right and as you can see there's a light up here and this same light is also inside the police station on top of the police station this could mean that the person in the casket could be actually living might actually be going ahead and visiting his his son who's in the police station right but however like he's in the casket right now though which could mean that he could have faked his death there's so many things happening inside Brookhaven and I'm really excited for the next update which could reveal what's actually happening inside of Brookhaven like I'm really excited if you guys are excited make sure you go ahead and comment down but I'm gonna be showing you something else as well that's really really creepy and no one on Brookhaven is really talking about this no no Brookhaven YouTubers are really talking this might actually be living and the abandoned house is actually getting updated as you guys saw so like on March there wasn't any light any light and in right now there's actually like a light light bulb up at the abandoned house if the person in the picture is actually living where could he be living right now right because the abandoned house it doesn't really seem like a place you can live 
like comfortably so i think the person's actually gonna be living in this house right here and this house is uh, like literally it's this house right here and you, you got some spawn it in, inside of, inside of brookhaven and this house actually looks very very similar to the house to the abandoned house inside of brookhaven and i can actually prove this so as you can see there's a two steps over here and these two steps are literally the same as the one at the abandoned house and inside it's also the same and as you can see the windows are also the same so it's literally the same window uh, um, attachment and let's go ahead and go over here and also once once i go this door over here it, like it's literally the same over here there's like a window over here and there's also, also like a crack over here but as you can see this wall is kind of different right here like compared to this wall over here right this wall is kind of different which, which could mean that this is actually patched over here and I, i'm kind of wondering right here i'm kind of wondering like i'm really wondering that if this house right here could be what the abandoned house inside of Brookhaven is actually be turning into. Like, I'm really wondering about this. Like, if you guys are wondering that, then make sure you guys go ahead and comment down below because I could not be the only person who's actually thinking that this house could be like what the abandoned house could be in, like in, in a few months inside of Brookhaven. But as you can see, we can, we can enter and there's also a light bulb over here. And this light bulb seems, seems to be like a lot more uh, better than the light bulb inside of the abandoned house right now. But it's in the same placement. Also, this house looks pretty pretty old like it looks pretty pretty old it, it, it looks like a, a house that could be owned by someone in the in the country right in the fields in the farms so it kind of looks like a house that could be in the farms and as you can see there's an old tv and old stuff over here and i really wonder if this is how he was actually living honestly like this th this house honestly looks like an old old house that could be owned by like someone in the country right it doesn't look very modern uh, anything like that like there's a secret base inside of brookhaven that you probably didn't know about and it's really really creepy and i'll be showing you the secret base right now and how you can access it and what it all means inside of brookhaven well, if you go to the hospital we can see a clue about the brand new secret base that's hidden so let's go ahead and, and by the way guys the secret base if, if i didn't tell you it's really really creepy so if you literally go ahead and enter inside the hospital and then we go to the extra room right here let's go to go to the extra room and if you go behind this like skeleton thing over here and we just go keep on going forward but you can just literally walk through here and we keep on going forward like this we can literally go ahead and see a letter right here and let me go ahead and get on, get on my binoculars so this report says it says report operation red river it literally says operation red river terminated so it's something that got terminated and i'll, I'll just re read it real quickly it says everyone said this time would be different nevertheless history did repeat itself i cannot pinpoint the power source however it looks to be beyond this world maybe history will show us the way as you can see the history is being highlighted a lot right here meaning that there's something about brookhaven's history that we don't know about and it's creating creepy vibes right now like did something in brookhaven's history happen and like everything's happening every single creepy secret we we're seeing is because of that like did something actually something really really weird really really creepy happen inside of brookhaven's history and if you put your camera angle just like i am right now you can go ahead and see a blue button right here and if you press on this blue button you'll be teleported right here and i'm pretty sure if you watch my other videos you know this however there's a hint about the secret base inside here and as you can see it literally said it says right here room activated meaning that there's a secret secret room or secret base inside of brookhaven that it's hinting towards so it's a secret room secret room activated right room activated meaning this is a base activated and it has an agency badge right here and this is really really important the agency has been doing some really really creepy things inside of brookhaven and we really don't know what the intentions of the agency is like they could be really weird they could be really really good for the uh, brookhaven society or they could be really really bad for it i guess there's only one way to find out is to go ahead and go to the secret room right now now i don't know any ways to actually go ahead and get out of here so i'm guessing i have to just go ahead and reset so if you're inside of here and you don't know how to get out i guess just reset your character all right so i'll be showing you where the exact location of the secret base is and how creepy it actually is and how all the, st uh, the story we have been like the secrets we've been unlocking inside of brookhaven actually relates to this like this is like a co really really cool story that brookhaven is actually like implementing inside their game and i really want to know more about this story honestly and i'll be keep on making more videos so make sure to stay tuned once you're at the street of brookhaven right the main street of brookhaven right here and here's where you spawn you can go ahead and go straight a tray like this and you can see the mall over here right at the mall you want to go ahead and turn left like this and you're gonna see a gas station right here and this gas station is pretty normal and hopefully it doesn't turn any creep anything creepy anytime 
soon. However, we already see the car wash right here. And as you can see in the car wash, there's like a creepy, I don't even know, there's like a weird thing right here that shouldn't be here. Like it should, it should just say like a, a regular A, right? But there's like a dot right here, like a red dot in, on the A, and I don't know what that means. However, if we go ahead and zoom in like this, and then we look at this, like where you basically start the car wash, right? Like if I click on it, the car wash just starts like there. As you can see, the car wash just starts. But as you can see, there's zero, 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 zero. There's like some kind of weird, weird code right here. And I don't know what this means, but it's probably something creepy. And I have no idea why there is. I don't know why there is like a red dot on the A. Like that's really, really creepy. I want to show you a secret base inside of Brookhaven that you probably didn't know about. It's really, really creepy. And it just got added in the brand new update. And a secret base, like you shouldn't be really be able to look at it, right? So it's going to be somewhere that you probably don't think it is and yes this is like this is like a weird weird place this is, this is a place that you might not think that there's a secret base inside here and it's gonna be right inside this wall right here in this mountain I guess I guess you call it like a hill or a mountain right here it's gonna be right inside here so if you just go ahead and go like this if you just go forward like this a door opens up and you can go ahead and go inside and this is really really creepy because you can see two agency badges right here meaning that the agency was probably here and it's like the agency's room agency's base agency's like i guess base so this is kind of really really creepy the agency's base right here and the agency is really really suspicious especially for, for me like they're really really suspicious like i've seen a lot of ton of agency badges i'll be showing you like later in this video if you want to see the whole story about the agency if you enter this room you can see like a ton of stuff right here a ton of cool stuff that just got added so you can see like two power sources over here which you really can't like turn off or turn on like at the power like if you if you don't know there's like a there's like a power source like somewhere around in brookhaven but as you can see you, you really can't turn on turn off and turn on these but you can turn off and turn on those and as you can see there's like a dot 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 right here in my last video i literally told you that that i didn't know a way to basically open up basket or whatever that had the code where you can basically enter the code inside the movies right i told you that it's kind of impossible to uh, it's kind of impossible to find this so i had to go ahead uh, basically glitch through it right if you go over to the agency ba base right here you can go ahead and go over here and then it's gonna be like this i'm pretty sure like if it's a brand new server it's probably gonna be like this and it, or if no one came into the agency room it's probably gonna be like this but what you want to do is you want to go ahead and make sure everything's gold and then after that if you go over to the abandoned house which i'll be doing later in this video you can actually see we have these circuits over here one two three four five and i wonder what it once the third circuit actually comes in, I wonder what's actually gonna happen. And as you can see, there's another, like, I guess, this is like kind of the thing that is inside the Brookhaven Electric. So I guess uh, later, in like a later update, maybe you can go, go ahead and click on it and then you can actually type in like a password and maybe we can actually turn these on and actually see what's gonna be happening to Brookhaven. Like, I'm really creeped out. If you guys are creeped out, then make sure you guys go ahead and comment down below. And also there's like a board here where you can basically type in anything. Make sure you use Starco Clean when you're buying Robux or Premium and that's what literally what I wrote, Starco Clean. So if you're buying Rebox or Premium, make sure you use Starco Clean. But however, as you can see above the board, it says, power on it literally says power on and i don't know what that means like it, it doesn't mean like the power inside the uh, the like the agency room like i i went ahead and i tr turned off the light right here right so if, if you turn off this light like it literally turns dark and i'm actually pulling out uh, a flashlight because it's so so dark so i have a, a flashlight right now because it's just really really dark and as you can see it still says power on so it's not the lights then it's something else and i hope that something else is not creepy let's go let's go ahead and turn this on there we go. I hope that something else is not creepy because if it is, then that's gonna be really, really bad inside of Brookhaven. But as you can see, there's some wires over here and a chair. But I want you to take a look at this right here. So everything's gold, and we're gonna be going ahead and going to the abandoned house. All right. So since the car wash has like a, a like on the A, it has like a red dot right here, right? I wonder if I actually get a car wash, something's at, if something's actually gonna be happening in my car or me. Let's go ahead and see. I'm gonna press this like green uh, red button right here. And hopefully, I, I think I can, I can, wait, hold on. I pressed it, there we go. Now I turn green, and hopefully, nothing really happens after I get a car wash. And nothing really happened, like, I, I, th I think my car is more clean right now. But and nothing happened, wait. 
it's also in the back as well like look at this back right here it also has a red dot at the a and i really don't know what that means and also guys look at the brookhaven room right there look at the brookhaven room that that's that's pretty cool the moon but let's go ahead and i'll be going to a location that actually is related to the secret base inside of brookhaven and it is all starts making sense this is really creepy guys so as you can see we're at the abandoned house one of the creepiest house i mean i guess the creepiest house inside of brookhaven the abandoned house and let me go ahead and turn off my lights because i don't want to i don't want the lights of my car to be affecting the abandoned house but let's go ahead and go into the abandoned house and as you can see once you go straight as you can see there's literally it's literally open and this only opens if you have everything on inside the agency base gold so if every every single circuit is uh, gold you can go ahead and unlock this and if it's unlocked you can see a secret code right here and this this code actually changes every single server so in this server it's seven two two zero zero so if i type that in into the movies you, i can actually see a movie but however as you can see we literally open this up and this all this all this is so creepy because the agency might actually be involved in this abandoned house which is really really creepy and i wonder if the agency is actually the government and if it's the government this is like i think i think if it's the government then but maybe they have some connection to the man inside the casket and if you don't know what the man inside the casket is but if you go inside the church inside of brookhaven just like this and you go inside this casket right here you can go ahead and see look at this the, uh, it still has the color they has uh, the color right there like it was black and white before but now it has color uh, since the branding update came up but as you can see you can see a man right here a picture of a man and it's inside this casket and it's really really creepy since it's inside the casket but we believe that the, the person right here the person right here but we believe that the person inside the casket right here the man inside the casket is actually a founder of brookhaven he's actually the founder of this whole Brookhaven city. Look at the city. Look at how big the city is. Like, he's the founder of it. And he's the founder of it in the old days, like when there was horses. Like, as you can see, there's like a horse right there. So there's a horse and there's like an old vehicle that basically no one uses nowadays because there's cars inside of Brookhaven. But yeah, this is this, this person has been inside that has created Brookhaven and this was back in the olden days and it did and uh, at the beginning of the video you guys saw that it says history will repeat itself history will rep repeat itself and I'm really worried about what kind of history is repeating itself because if it does I don't know what we're gonna have inside of Brookhaven like are we gonna have like a flood like this it's raining right now and also like we we, we saw some water inside the secret room right so i wonder if there's actually be a flood inside of brookhaven as i can see we're at the movies and i'm actually been going ahead and entering the code that we got at the abandoned house someone someone's already playing the movie like everyone knows the secret by the way nowadays so this is a, this is the movie about the old man has a good tea it's the man in the abandoned house right now this man is the person inside the casket and he founded brookhaven and his name is actually brookhaven which is pretty cool and he named i guess he named the town of brookhaven and by 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 his name right and I'm, I'm i'm starting to believe that the agency and this man have some kind of connection because like the only reason why we got the code to, to be able to play this movie was through the agency base and once you go to the agency base you can activate something that basically unlocks a code and you can basically use the code over here right which which prompts me to believe that this actually might be the agency like the agency might actually have connections to this guy or maybe they did something to him like if you go over to the hospital so as you can see we're in the secret room and all this starts making sense like all these secrets that we found inside of brookhaven starts making sense so let me go ahead and put out put everything and every single thing every single secret we saw in brookhaven actually starts making sense there's the agency badge over here and we already see it saw the secret agency base and if you go over to the observation room some people actually believe this person right here might be the old man the man inside the casket or and the man in the movies that we just saw he might be this guy right here like look at this this is kind of creepy like especially since there is an agency badge right here and we just came into the agency badge which is really really creepy like this is really really creepy like if this is actually the man inside the casket like i mean he wait wait i i just noticed something guys this like the, i guess this zombie is inside the casket and the person in the casket in, in, in the pre picture is inside the casket wait could this actually be the guy inside the the picture of the guy inside the casket like uh, mr brookhaven we, we know his name it's mr brookhaven 
Could oh my god, that's really creepy. Like, I'm getting really creepy. I found secret messages inside of Brookhaven that literally shocked me, and it will, it will probably shock you too. These secret messages are kind of creepy, and I want to go ahead and look at them. So if we go ahead and go over to the mall right here, right? So let's go and go over to the mall, and I'll be showing you some secret messages, and then we'll be going to this first, con I guess, the movies right here. But as you can see, we can see this movie right here, right? And there's a hidden message in this movie, and a hidden place in this movie that we can go to and unlock the mystery of Brookhaven. All right. So right here in the scene, we can go ahead and see that Mr. Brookhaven pulls out something like a light thing. And I don't really know what this is. Like, let me know in the comment section down below what your theories are about this. But as you can see, he also patches it up police station right here being built and we can also see like these apartments right here the modern day apartments and we can see the police station built right here and i want you to go ahead and take a look at what the police station does so police stations are basically created by the government right? and departments in the government like departments in the government are usually called agencies and there's an agency inside of brookhaven that's been going around and it's a big big mystery what this movie is basically telling us is that there is something with the agency that mr brookhaven is with so there's connections between Brookhaven and the agency and let's go ahead and actually take a look at the same scene again so as you can see here's the same scene and this is the modern day police station and this are these are the apartments right here and take a look at the trees right here and trees usually last for a very very long time we can see a light green tree right here and we can see a dark green tree right there and, and keep in mind those trees because trees can actually last a very very long time now i actually showed you guys this in the last video right and this is actually not the secret message i'm going to be actually going ahead and tying everything up that i just told you guys if you go ahead and go over here we can see we can go ahead and see a light green tree right here right and we can also go out and see a dark green tree right here basically this is where the police station is right here and this is where like the apartments are so in my opinion this is actually the old place that was in the scene and i don't know why this police is approaching me right now i don't know what i did uh, maybe because i parked my lamborghini the wrong, wrong way hopefully it doesn't say anything i'm just gonna run away he has his lights on as well so I, i'm pretty sure i'm kind of in trouble but as i told you there is a police station right here right and we saw a police station being built and the police is actually gonna be i don't know if he's chasing me or not i mean hopefully he's not and i told you that the, the police station i mean the police is controlled by the government if you go ahead and go over this rotten robbie i guess gas station which has expensive gas prices like i'm not paying five dollars for gas but if you go over here and then you basically go ahead and go through this wall right here like this wall right here you can go ahead and go in the agency base and i'm pretty sure most of you know where i'm taking this story too so basically the agency in my opinion is the government because who can actually build this can any one single person basically build this and the government has a ton of resources so basically if you go ahead and go inside the agency base we can go ahead and uncover some secret messages that has not been revealed to the public or reveal something about the government about the agency and maybe even about the history of brookhaven but let's go ahead and actually read these messages so if i go ahead and actually turn off this light right here if you go ahead and if you turn off this light right here it, it turns dark right and i didn't really know why people were actually turning off this light however if you actually turn off the light you can go ahead and see a secret message and all you have to do is go inside the space right here in the agency base and you're gonna see this paper right here and i was always wondering like why was there a paper right here however it was for a secret message so if you go ahead and go over here you can go ahead and read the secret message and it's not in english it's in another language so basically what i'm gonna be doing is i'm actually been going ahead and searching this up because like i don't need i don't really know what this is this is not english this is another language and let's go ahead and search this up i just typed in the secret message that we just got inside of Brookhaven and things just got creepier as you can see right here it says truth prevails and that is kind of creepy truth prevails like what does that mean the truth is the ultimate power i'm pretty sure or maybe this means that the truth is actually going to be exposed very very soon and i'm really concerned about what the truth is like could it be dark it might actually be dark because as you can see this room is dark and you have to make the room dark in order to actually go ahead and see the secret message and i don't know i'm, I'm kind of worried about the dark stuff that the agency has done I, I wonder who wrote this message like could it be the agency or could it not be because if it was the agency i'm pretty sure it would appear if you go ahead and actually turn on the lights right it, it would appear but it does not appear if i go in and turn on the lights and i go over here right like i cannot see the message right here but if i actually go ahead and turn off the lights has this off we can actually go out and see the message so i'm wondering that this is probably not written by the 
agency. It's probably written by someone else that does not want the agency to actually go out and see this message. And I really wonder if that person's actually going to be exposing the truths of the agency. I really wonder what the one of the ground says. Like, I wonder if it says anything. So let's go ahead and see. I don't think it really says anything. If you know in the comment, if you know what it does, what that a second letter is right there then let me know in the comment section down below and also as you can see this chair is flipped flipped like this right and i'm guessing that something actually something weird something creepy maybe someone's maybe the agency's actually suppressing this person right here maybe that actually happened because someone probably got mad and because of that this chair is actually like flipped upside down like this and that's kind of creepy like but i really hope the truth prevails inside of brookhaven and we actually get to see what the agency does however there's actually another secret message right behind me yes it's right behind me and if you go ahead and turn around we can see a orange thing right here and in order to actually see the secret message Message, you're gonna have to go ahead and glitch in and in order to glitch in so the first thing you don't need to do is go ahead and click on the backpack right here and then all you have to do is scroll down until you see a sleeping bag so let's go ahead and scroll down and we see a sleeping bag right here right it's gonna get a sleeping bag and once you get the sleeping bag all you have to do is go ahead and go over the wall right like this like face like this right and then all you have to do is put in put in your bag like this and then we can go ahead and get on the bag and hopefully we can actually see what's here okay Okay, we can see it a little bit right now. Okay, I hope you guys can see it right now. It says T S L V L three. So I'm guessing it's T S level three, level three, like in the levels. This says L V L, right? And usually levels are basically abbreviated by L V E. So I'm guessing the saying level three, and then it says T. S. I, I don't know what TS really means. I don't know what this message is actually trying to say right here inside of Brookhaven. But it's kind of creepy that it's inside the wall and it's a hidden message that no one wants or the person who basically put the message right there does not want you to know. And let me know in the comment section down below what you think of this secret message. Like what could this actually be saying? Like the only thing I got out of this was that it's a, there's level three. And basically that's the only thing I got out of this. But I'm pretty sure some of you actually can go ahead and get more out of this like secret message right here. Let's go ahead and I want to go outside and see if there's actually something outside of the agency base. So let's go ahead and go outside and we can actually go outside from here or from, I'm pretty sure there's another place we can, wait, from here I'm pretty sure, yeah. You can go ahead and go outside from here. And of course it's dark, so we're gonna have to use a flashlight. But as you can see, we can see some wires over here and these wires are pretty common. However, it's from like the mountains. It's like from a, this is like a remote location, right? Where no one really thinks the base is. So let's go ahead and see, there's more wires right here. Like, I guess it's nothing, nothing too crazy. Nothing like worrying, right? So let's go ahead and see more. We, we, we're not seeing anything right here. Okay, we see some wires and i'm pretty sure most of i'm pretty sure some of you have actually been here like if you're really really curious about what's going on in brookhaven actually some wires going up to the mountain and i really don't know what that we didn't really see find anything in the outskirts of the agency but i'm kind of creeped out when i heard truth prevails inside of the agency base because like i really wonder what that truth is right and i want to show you something that the agency did that is probably done. needs to be exposed by whoever wrote that message that said the truth prevail so above the hospital all of you know this that there is a room of the, above the hospital and if you go inside this room we can go ahead and see the observation room right here and we've always been mystery like there's always some kind of mystery about this room like that we can't really explain right however if you go ahead and go inside we can actually see what kind of truth might be, be might be being prevailed after the person who wrote the message like reveals, exposes the agency. So as you can see, this is called the observation room right here. And you might be thinking, wait, they're probably absorbing cells. They're probably absorbing like diff different kinds of stuff, right? But no, zombie, this could be a zombie. This could be an alien or even a human. And if it is a human, that is so creepy. And that is so, so dark. And if you go ahead and go even forward, we can go ahead and see a agency badge right here. Very, very good chance that the agency has actually done this to this man, to this alien, to this zombie. We really don't know what this is, but still, this is really, really dark stuff and it's tied to the agency. Now, another dark thing that the agency might have done is inside the, like, if you go ahead and go inside the hospital, we can go ahead and go inside the x-ray room, right? And once you go inside the x-ray room, I'm pretty sure most of you know that you can go ahead and hop behind this and then we can go ahead and go inside. And once we go inside, we're going to see the secret message right here that I've read several times on the channel. However, if you go ahead and put your camera angle like this and you can go ahead and click on the screen button right here, this blue button. 
we can go ahead and teleport to this room right here, right? And once we teleport to this room, there's an agency badge right here. Meaning that the agency has something to do with this creepy, creepy, like, place right here. Like, it's kind of dark, and I don't really know what goes on here. All right, let's go ahead and actually go get out of sight of here, because the agency is freaking me out. And also, in my previous videos, I usually, when I we usually go inside this room, right? I usually can't, I, I usually told you guys that I can't get out of here. However, today, I've actually found out a way to get out. So if you go ahead and go to this column right here at the end, and you basically want to turn your camera angle like this, you can see a green button right here. And once you press it, you're going be teleported to i guess lake madison right here which is kind of creepy and lake madison and that like secret room have something in common and lake madison and the agency have something in common if that is true right and that is probably true because we just got teleported to lake madison so lake madison and the agency what can happen? Like, a Lake Madison is literally the biggest body of water inside of Brookhaven. And if something happens to this, like, the whole map could be flooded. But if you guys do like getting free stuff, like free game passes in Brookhaven, then make sure to go out and check out today's sponsor, CleanUpers.com. So once you go on CleanUpers.com, all you gotta do is click on next. Once you click on next, make sure to scroll down and to put in your Roblox CD. Once you put in your Roblox CD, make sure you go out and hit on connect. Once you hit on connect, you can do two offers. And once you do those two offers, you can go ahead and uh, go onto Roblox Brookhaven, and you can basically go ahead and get any of these passes right here. Thank you so much for CleanUpers.com for sponsoring this video. However, as I told you, Lake Madison and the agency might actually be going ahead. There's a button inside of brick cave and that can actually go ahead and unlock a cave and when i heard about this i was actually really surprised because i didn't believe this was possible however once i actually test this out this actually works so i'm gonna be going ahead and showing you exactly where the button is if you go ahead and go inside the hospital right here right so let's go to go inside the hospital right now and inside the hospital there's actually several buttons and one of these buttons actually unlocks a cave so if i go ahead and enter inside the hospital go ahead and see this drawer right here and this dryer literally has a uh, medical records open which means someone inside i guess inside Inside the hospital has have went through these medical records and also if you go ahead and go under this desk right here right you can go ahead and see this light right here now this light is either green or red so right now it's green and this light right here could be connected to these medical records right here which i'll be making a video about later however let me go ahead and talk about the secret button if we go to the gas station which has like really expensive gas prices and then you go ahead and go all the way over to the secret cave i guess the secret bunker right here so it's going to go to the secret bunker and once we're here you can go ahead and go to this uh, this table right here right and once you go to this table you can go ahead and turn your camera angle like this and you're actually gonna be seeing a secret button right here and many people think that the secret button actually doesn't do anything but it actually does someone actually wrote here secret base for minecraft flares i don't know what this person's doing in like a roblox game he's, he's just playing uh, putting minecraft flares in the roblox game but as you can see there's actually a secret button right here and let me go ahead and actually see if this actually goes ahead and unlocks a secret cave now you're gonna have to go over here and you are gonna have to turn each one of these circuits into like this gold color right here so it's gonna do this one two i guess oh, one two three four five and for some reason the third circuit is missing and if you know why the third circuit is missing then make sure you go ahead and comment down below all right this person just tried to steal my bugatti so i had to go ahead and lock it because like i don't know why but people just like to see my bugatti now another button inside of brookhaven that can actually unlock something is gonna be this button right here near the car wash right here and especially since the car wash has like a circle inside the a which isn't really normal so let's go ahead and actually click on this button and once you click on this button it's gonna turn green right here and once it turns green you can go ahead and go through this car brush right here and hopefully this guy doesn't get washed up <laughs> from the car wash and it's really really like it's not healthy oh there we go he just, he just i think he was feeling really uncomfortable really not good for your skin however we're trying to unlock the cave inside of brookhaven right so the button that i was thinking was those two buttons because they're next to the secret base however there's actually another secret button that can actually go ahead and unlock something crazy so if i go and go over here and i'm gonna be pulling out my uh, ladder right here so it's gonna go up here with my ladder and you can go ahead and go through this window right here and once you go to the window all you have to do is go through this door and you're gonna see this zombie right here now this zombie uh, i assume is like a woman because a lot of people are saying this is like it looks like a woman however if you go ahead and actually go ahead and put your camera angle like this you can go ahead and actually see a secret button right here and many people are theorizing that this, this secret button right here might actually do something now this secret button actually was like red and green before before the update so now it's actually why? Meaning that this secret button could actually do something. So let me go ahead and actually click on it and see what it does. So let me go ahead and click on it. I'm gonna click on three times just to make sure that I actually clicked on it. So let's gonna do this. One, two, three. Now there's actually another secret button behind the church that we all know of. And I was always wondering what this secret button does, but we might actually have a theory as to what the secret button actually might do. 
So as you can see, this sticker button is the same shape as the island at Lake Madison. And also this, this church right here has a bell and this bell can actually go ahead and activate. And, the, and since this bell is actually getting energy right here, right? To go ahead and activate, there are actually energy pyramids that I've shown you in several videos. And these energy pyramids and also the shape of the button that we just saw, it's like shaped like uh, the Lake Madison Island, right? Could be hinting towards something like a secret cave being at Lake Madison. And if you go ahead and go inside this frat house right here, so let's go and go inside the frat house right now, and hopefully it's not locked. Oh my god, it's locked. Come on, bro. All right, so we're gonna be just going ahead and I guess glitching in here because it's locked. Someone actually locked it, which is good for them, but not for me. So let's go and go inside here, and you want to go ahead and go inside the basement, and I really don't know what these symbols mean. Like these symbols change every single server, but as you can see, we can go inside here. We can click on the secret button, and we can go inside here, right? And once you go inside here, there's actually like a secret, I guess, crystal right here, which is like the same thing, uh, I guess, the same crystal as the one inside the church. And inside this, it's actually hinting towards something. So if we go ahead and go all the way until the end right here, this last pillar right here, we can go ahead and actually put a place our ladder like this, and then once you place your ladder, many if you know this there's actually a secret button and this secret button is actually the same like shape as the one at lake madison and i was really thinking like what could this actually mean this means that there's actually something inside of lake madison a secret cave of some some sort and there's actually a button that can reveal all of this it's actually going to be inside of the hospital right here so if you go on and go inside the hospital and if you go ahead and go inside the extra room like this and you go behind this like skeleton thing over here and you go through this wall right here you can actually go ahead and click on the secret button. Now, this is not the secret button that actually unlocks the cave. Although it unlocks like a body water that is really, really secretive. And I don't really know what that really means. Like there's like the agency badge, which means that the agency might actually be involved in this. However, let me go ahead and actually click on this button and we're going to be seeing everything. So as you can see, the, this is the agency badge. Well, hold on. Where is it? This is the agency badge I was talking about. And here it says declination offline meaning that probably someone probably doesn't have like a it seems like somebody doesn't have the book right here so i'm gonna have to actually go ahead and get the book you can actually go ahead and unlock the escape and if you want to do this as well here's what you're gonna have to do so you want to go out go ahead and go into any vacant place and you want to go ahead and click on this vacant place and once you click on it all you have to do is go ahead and scroll down and then click uh, scroll down all the way and you want to click on this jungle house right here now once you click on the jungle house it's going to be building up now as you can see this like i guess nature house jungle house you can call it i, I don't know why i call it the jungle house i should probably call it the nature house it's like a really really luxurious house and it has like a ton of secrets that i've gone over in several videos on my channel and one of the secrets i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna just give it to you free one of the secrets is gonna be this shovel right here <laughs> and it's like you know it's like a cool shovel that you, that you can farm in like I would assume you can farm in this, but there's actually a hidden secret in there. You can actually go ahead and go through this, which all of you guys probably know. But as you can see, if you go ahead and go inside this room right here, you can actually go ahead and click on this quantum theory book. And if you have this quantum theory book, you can actually go ahead and unlock this cave. Unlock, I guess, the writing of this cave. And I cannot believe someone, uh, like, no one actually had the book inside uh, inside their hand or inside their inventory. But if I actually go ahead and go inside the hospital again, and I go inside the extra room right here, go behind this, and I click on this button right here. Let me go ahead and click on it. And now I go ahead and actually go to this other end right here. Let me, go, let me actually go ahead and go to this other end. Oh my god, I can't even swim. Look at this. I don't even know what I was doing right there. But let's go ahead and go all the way until the end. Wait, no, not this one. Let's go ahead and get all the way. Wait, room activated. As you can see, it's going to say room activated once I actually get the button. And um, I guess a book, not the button. Oh my god, okay. We're gonna go all the way over here, and it's gonna say seek the bottom of a hill to find the dirt that once was filled. And, and it has this person right here with a transparent image. And this guy is actually a SWAT guy, if you don't know. However, as you can see, it says seek the bottom of a hill to find the dirt that once was filled. And this kind of out of the bottom of a hill, this kind of seems like a cave, right? This kind of seems like a cave. So there's actually a secret button right here that can actually go ahead and tell us where this, like, um, Whereas this bottom of the hill that once was filled with. And many of us were thinking that it was going to be like the secret uh, agency base, right? And that st still could be possible. However, there could actually be something else hidden inside the room that could uh, show us, hidden hidden button inside this room that can show us where this, I guess, patch of land is. Or this secret cave is. So let's go ahead and all you have to do inside this room, all you have to do is go, oh my god, what am I doing here? Okay, all you have to do is go all the way until the end like this, all the way until the end. And you're gonna have to go ahead and go to the secret button right here. This is a secret button. All you have to do is click on it. And once you click on it, you're gonna be teleported to Lake Madison. And there's actually a secret cave inside Lake Madison that can explain everything. And it's gonna be this type of like, I guess, cave right here. And there's actually like a big, big cave near this cave right here. So if I go and actually swim faster, hopefully I can swim faster here. And hopefully my flashlight doesn't like die, uh, die out because uh, it's soaked. But let's go ahead and go all the way over here. And I've been to this cave before. 
I've been to this cave before. However, if I go go ahead and actually go all the way over here, as you can see, this is kind of a scary cave. But let's go ahead and go all the way over here. Now, this, could this like the part of land? It's got, it's kind of under a hill, right? So could this part of land actually be something that was filled up with dirt? Let me know in the comments down below. But as you can see, we can go all the way inside here, and I thought this was like a cave, right? But it's actually not the cave. Like I literally thought this was a cave, but it's not. However, it's actually right next to Lake Madison, and I was right about that. It's actually land right next to Lake Madison because we got teleported Lake Madison once we click on the button. So let me go in and actually get off the water, uh, water because if I'm on, in the water, it's actually gonna be like really, really slow. But let's go ahead and actually go all the way over to this location right here. And it's actually gonna be near the uh, Lake Madison because this, this location right here is near Lake Madison, right? So it's gonna go all the way over here and it's gonna be a, a cave near here. All right, so in order to actually access this cave, what you need to do is to go ahead and go all the way up like this, all the way up like this, and as you can see, you're gonna you're gonna be right here, right? But you wanna go ahead and keep on going up, keep on going up, and as you can see, you're gonna access this secret cave right here. Oh my God, look at how big this cave is, guys. Look, oh my, okay, I just fell down. No, okay. But did you guys just see how big that cave was? Do you guys just see how big this cave is? Look at how big this cave is, guys. Oh my God, but make sure to not fall down through this because you can actually go ahead and fall down into the, into the map under the map which is not good it's gonna have to make sure not to do this but however look at this this is such a big cave right here i cannot believe when i actually found this let me let me go ahead and actually pull out my flash right here look at how big this cave is like there's more cave over there like i couldn't believe it when i actually found this cave but now there's actually like a little bit of a uh, land over here let me actually get a, get down here but as you can see look at how big this is and let me go ahead and actually see if, if we can actually find something so as you can see look at how big this cave is and this cave is probably hinting towards something and we wouldn't have found this cave if we, we didn't actually go ahead and uh, go to click on the secret button right which hinted towards something being in lake madison and if i go ahead and actually get on my binoculars right here we can actually go out and see some body of water right here meaning that lake madison and this cave are actually touching there might actually be something happening between lake madison and this secret cave right here and let me know in the comments down below what your series are because it's actually kind of creepy let's go ahead and see like with my binoculars let's go ahead and see if there's anything hidden anything like suspicious about this cave now since this cave is actually like at the corner of the map right this cave is actually gonna be, gonna be like really really secretive and that's probably why uh the developer brick came and actually put this cave over here because he didn't he didn't want us to find this and if he actually found this it's gonna be uh it's gonna be like a dead sentence because if you actually go ahead and go down here you can actually die i'll be showing you the safe in the brand new penthouse inside of brookhaven so we just got a brand new update inside of brookhaven and we got like a ton of vehicles like uh, one of my favorite vehicles inside this update is gonna be this vehicle right here but we also got a brand new penthouse that someone already claimed right here and i'm gonna be showing you the secret safe and also there's a secret room inside this brand new penthouse that you probably didn't know about but one of my favorite cars is this this car right now you do have to have premium to get this car this is literally like a bugatti inside of brookhaven right here which is pretty pretty cool and we also got a ton of other a ton of other vehicles such as the military vehicles over here and we also got like this one which you need like the vehicle pass to get and we also got this one right here i'm, pretty, I'm gonna i'm gonna just pull it out because um for those who don't have premium so i'm just gonna pull it out right here as you can see, this is like literally like a, I guess a van or like a car that you can, you know, role play with. But let's go ahead and go to the brand new penthouse. And this penthouse is actually like one of the best penthouses that you can get. Like, I mean, I, I guess this is like the best penthouse you can literally get inside of Brookhaven. So as you can see, uh, I'm, I'm going to actually go ahead and try to glitch in here. So all you got to do is get a sweet sleeping bag and then you can go ahead and glitch in. And let me just go ahead and glitch in like this. There we go. And then look at this penthouse. Like literally, I'm going to turn up like my graphics all the way up. And as you can see, this penthouse is so, so cool. Like, but as you can see, we're in the brand new penthouse right here. And we can go outside. And like, this is kind of, this is kind of a cool design right here. Like, I guess this pulls up like this. Oh, this, this, I think this person owns the penthouse. So she's actually going to be trying to ban me. But hopefully not. But before she bans me, I'm going to actually go ahead and show you a safe right here. So basically... This is brand new penthouse, right? And as you can see, you can really take a look around here. And also there's like a room inside here. So basically, let me go ahead and actually glitch in. And there's actually a secret room inside this like wall right here. As you can see, there's a brand new secret room inside here and I'm glitching out right here. Oh, I just I just got banned from the penthouse. As you can see, we're in the brand new penthouse and this penthouse looks very, very cool. Like, look at this, like, it has like a blue interior right here. There's a ball right here. And there's also a secret room right here that you can basically, you know, close it. Like, if you click on this button right here, you can basically go ahead and close it. And there's also like a pretty cool balcony. So let me go ahead and actually glitch in, uh, glitch out. And I should show you like this balcony right here. Look at this, look at how, look, you get the whole view of Brookhaven right here. You can see the police station right here. You can see the motel, you can see like, 
where people spawn right here the brookhaven park i guess you can see the swimming pool right there and we can also see like the whole town of brookhaven which is pretty pretty cool and it's like i guess it's lifted up by like this wall right here kind of this wall which is pr a pretty cool design honestly and also there's a pool up here which is really really cool as well as you can see we already have a secret room right here and i don't really know what this means like this kind of thing is kind of in like the jungle house or like the nature house that just that came out like a week ago i think so i don't really know what this really means inside of Brookhaven but as you can see we have like a two like a bed right here two bunker bed and and then we also have like a table right here with a computer with a cool cool computer which is pretty cool like it lights up right here which is which is really really cool and we also like i don't even know what this is like i guess for cameras and stuff right if you're like a youtuber and let's go ahead and see over here there's like a disco well you can basically go ahead and host a party inside here which is really really cool inside the penthouse like i mean if you're if you have a penthouse right you're probably really really rich so this is kind of a cool addition and there's also a ladder that goes up to like the swimming pool but we also have like these things over here i don't know or i don't really know what these things are but as you can see I have, my crystal lights up and we also have like a way we also have like an indoor pool right here inside this fan house this is like a party house i guess which is really really cool and there's also like a fireplace right here which is really cool as well like this penthouse looks extremely cool and there's like wait i think these are like more secret rooms right here there's another secret room inside here which is like one bed right here like one full bed right here and there's another secret room right here like these rooms look really really cool like this penthouse looks like the best penthouse that you can get and all right, the owner just took away the penthouse. But let me go ahead and actually buy this penthouse. So I'm gonna bitch buy it right now. As you can see, I just I just bought it. Oh, penthouse purchase. Oh my god, I just bought it. Okay. All right, so the penthouse that we are obviously gonna be spawning is gonna be this penthouse right here, right? So it's gonna spawn this penthouse. All right, so as we enter this penthouse right here, we can see like a ladder up here. We can see like this. I don't even know what I don't even know what these like purple things are, or, like these green things are. Uh, I have no idea. Like you guys need to let me know in the comments down below what those things are. Let's go ahead and here's the secret bedroom. So basically, you can go ahead and close it like this as you can see i just closed it right but you can also go ahead and open it and once you open it you're gonna be in the secret bedroom right here and then i can close it again as you can see and no one's really gonna know i'm here which is pretty pretty cool and there's also like i don't even know what this like lights over here neon lights which is really like this house looks very very cool so there's like two beds right here you can just basically go ahead and hide inside this room. No, no one really knows you're gonna be inside this room, right? Except like for this window over here, which I don't, I don't really think like a lot of people are gonna be able to, you know, see. There's like a disco bar right here. This is really, really cool. Like, look at this. Like, you can basically go ahead and host a party or something. So I think I can do Wolf. Like, I think that's like, yeah, there we go. The Wolf emo right here, which is a pretty, pretty like secretive emo, right? Like, you just have to type in Wolf and then look at this. I can basically have a party inside here. This is like definitely like a party house. I want to go ahead and check out the rest of this penthouse right here. So we have a fireplace right here, which I can basically go ahead and turn on. As you can see, the fireplace, pretty, pretty cool fireplace. We have two couches over here, pretty, pretty cool. And also this like a, a blind, I guess, or like, and above here, we can go ahead and see the pool right here. So let me go ahead and actually turn on my graphics all the way up. And as you can see, we, we have the pool up here. And this pool is really, really cool. Like, look at this. Like, it's like an infinity edge pool right here. Like a really, really cool pool. And like, I mean, I feel like I feel like the graphics kind of improve right here because like, look at this. This water is like really, really cool. Like to the sunset. I mean, it's sunrise. And obviously, you can look at the whole. And here's the kitchen. This kitchen looks pretty, pretty cool. But there's actually a secret safe inside this house. And it's basically going to be right here inside the bathroom right here. And I think, wait, can we actually hide up here? I don't know if we can hide up at the, wait. We, yeah, you can actually hide here. Wait, yeah, you can you can kind of hide here, I guess. Yeah, you can hide right here, right? Look at this. You can basically hide here. But also, let me see. But the secret safe is actually going to be through this, like, bathroom window over here. So I can just basically go in here. And as you can see, there's a secret safe right here, which is pretty, pretty cool. So basically, if I go ahead and go to the uh, vehicles right here, right? And I basically go ahead and click on the military vehicles right here. This is like a tank right here. I, I like this tank. I really like this tank, as you can see. It's like a pretty, pretty cool tank. And I really wonder, like, if I get up here, like, what this app, like, let me, there's like a seat up here. So let me go ahead and actually get up here. And uh, can I actually like shoot these? I don't, I don't know if I can shoot these. I guess I guess we have to go ahead and get a gun, right? And there we go. I can basically act like, you know, this is shooting things. Although I'm uh, I'm having a gun right here, right? But hey, this is like a pretty, pretty cool tank. Like this is a really, really cool tank. And we also have like a military, like I guess cargo right here. And we, I think we can actually like name this anything we want. So I'm gonna name it, hello. Let's go ahead and see if it actually, oh, there we go. It actually pops up right here. So I can just say hello and then we can basically go ahead and you know there's people can also like uh, sit here people can also sit in the back which is pretty pretty cool and also i told you again there's like a wait a possible house fire at your house catch 
a fire. Oh my God, there's a house fire at my house. I'm a brand new house. That's like millions and millions of dollars, right? Oh, someone just said that they love my videos. I'm gonna say thank you so much. Like, thank you so much, guys, for all the support. But as you can see, this is like another car that you need premium for. As you can see, this is like literally this car right here. And this is the Bugatti inside of Brookhaven, which is really, really cool. And I talked about this. As you can see, like, everyone has like a white Bugatti right now. There's a pink, like, a, I guess, a yellow Bugatti right there. <laughs> someone just crashed. But as you can see, this is a really, really cool, uh, like, I mean, honestly, like, supercar right here inside of Brookhaven. Like, I really like the supercar. Uh, all we had was like the Lamborghini, right? But now we have a Bugatti and there's gonna be like way more role plays inside of Brookhaven because it's this brand new Bugatti. And also I guess we have like a new brand new like Jeep, I guess this is. So let's go, let me go ahead and actually get in this Jeep and I'm gonna be turning the color. Let me go ahead and turn the color as this. And there's actually, look at this. There's actually a window up here, which is really, really cool. There's like a window above the ceiling. And let me see. This is this is a really cool car as well. Like, look at this. This is a really really cool car. I like. I, I especially like the window above here. Like, that's a really cool window. And I'm pretty sure this like update has a like a ton of secrets inside that. Apparently, there are certain houses inside of Brookhaven that you're not supposed to get. And we have this stuck here that says, "Hey guys." So today I'm gonna be showing you why not to get this house in Brookhaven. What? I think I think I've had this house out a long a lot of times. So let's go see why you shouldn't have this. Okay. So now we're gonna go through the gate. Wait, this person like a bacon here, which. I'm not gonna underestimate, but let's see. So then you zoom out and there's a door in the elevator, okay. And oh my God, what's happening? Wait, the dinosaur is carrying me in Brookhaven. What is going on here? Okay, that's, that's like the creepiest thing that ever happened to me. And uh, I, you probably shouldn't be getting that house out if this happens to you as well. So it's gonna get the exact house out that she got out in the TikTok. I'm gonna go over here and actually get out the house. All right, so I think the house was like one of these. I mean, obviously it's one of these, but it's good. I think it was this one. I think it was this one right here that she took out. And apparently this house right here, according to TikTok, you're not supposed to get out and it uh, a creepy thing or whatever. So let's go to go over here and I'm gonna hop over this like fence thingy, which is exactly what he did. And now we all we have to do is go over here according to the bacon here, right? And we have to go over here. And then now it says, then you zoom in and zoom out and then voila, what? Okay, let me try, let me try that and I, I exactly see why you shouldn't get this house out. And apparently there's also like more houses you're not supposed to get out. So we're gonna be checking those houses out as well, but let's go over here and let's go ahead and do the chapter of the secret. I'll have to zoom in, zoom out, and then I have to click on the button, right? The elevator thing and what? I literally just get teleported, although I wasn't even in the elevator. Like, that's so weird. And the TikTok also says, and there's a safe. So to remember, no, do not get this house in Brookhaven. So apparently, since this house is a safe, uh, we're not supposed to get it. I don't really know what the what, what's wrong with the safe, honestly. Or right, so apparently, there's another house you're not supposed to visit, and it's going to be the man visits the abandoned house in Brookhaven. And I exactly know where the abandoned house is, and I don't know what's happening. Why is dinosaur trying to, like, pull me up all the way over there? Like, the dinosaur's obviously literally hacking right now. All we got to do is go over to the haunted house i guess or the abandoned house which is like right over i think the edge of the map so i'm gonna be going over this so let me just go ahead and do this all right so you just turn that as well so hopefully nothing happens here hopefully no like creepy ghosts appear at the abandoned house but as you can see here's the abandoned house that you you all saw in the tiktok and apparently you're not supposed to go inside here or anything but you know what i'm gonna go in i don't care i don't care about those like i guess scary myths or anything okay, apparently there's secret things in the uh, brick came in the abandoned house as you can see secret things in the abandoned house now go to the abandoned house if the box thing is not open glitch in with the sleeping bag okay Apparently, there's something with the box thing in the abandoned house. Let's go and see what happens here. So we're going to go ahead and get out our sleeping bag right here, as you can see. But let's go ahead and put our sleeping bag like this. And as you can see, the James person already put, put their sleeping bag like that. And now all we got to do is go do like this. There we go. And then now, according to the TikTok, it says this might take long. I mean, it didn't take very long for me. And then now, as you can see, she's in the sleeping bag right here. And now, what is she going to say? So then get a paper and pencil and write down the code. Oh, the code right there. Okay, I really hope this is not like creepy or anything. But as you can see, there's, there's obviously some numbers over here and if you put these numbers into the movie section you can actually go ahead and get a movie out you should not get this house out at night wait and the dino's scaring me bro okay this is so scary right now i don't know what's happening spawn the devil's house bro what dude it's literally night right now and i'm literally kind of scared right now to get out this house especially if it's night in brookhaven and okay you know what i'm gonna scroll down and as you can see the devil's house this is the devil's house that she's talking about i'm pretty sure and has a red border around it i, I don't know what's gonna happen once i get this house Ho hopefully nothing happens hopefully nothing happens and we're gonna go inside and it's so dark inside here there's coffins there's boxes okay so go to the church and ring the bell three times and and the, wait what is the dinosaur oh. doing the dinosaur trying to like force me to go to the church okay okay do you know what i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna do what the dinosaur oh. says i'm gonna go over to church and I'm, I'm gonna go to ring it three times there we go i'm gonna ring it once as you can see and once i ring it again as you can see there's two times and then third time i'm gonna ring it the third time as well and then it's gonna the light above the church is gonna disappear and i'm kind of scared right now wait what what is this person saying it's like it's not even scary but 
it's night in Brookhaven, but it's night in Brookhaven, and I got the devil's uh, house you are not supposed to get. Because apparently you're not supposed to get these houses. Low kid isn't scary. You're just a baby. Oh my God. Maybe I shouldn't be scared. You know, maybe I shouldn't be scared. Maybe it's not like too scary. What if it's real? What if if you actually got out, got out of the house, you, you'd like see a jump scare or something? And the dinosaur is like, don't listen to this ugly brat. Oh my God. Now visit the abandoned house. Okay, this just gets creepier and creepier and creepier. And this girl's like the abandoned house isn't even that scary. Uh, maybe for you, use the tank to get there. Uh, I don't know why I have to use the tank. I mean, the tank is like kind of big, as you can see. Anyways, we're gonna get the tank right here, as you can see. And honestly, the tank is going pretty, pretty fast right here. The tank is going pretty fast. We're gonna go all the way over to the abandoned house in Brickhaven. I'm kind of scared. I'm kind of scared. I, I don't know if y'all are scared, but I'm kind of scared right now. I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm not supposed to be getting these houses out, in, especially at night in Brickhaven. Don't ask me if you guys get like a night scare or something, or like a nightmare or jump scare or something like that when you get at this Brookhaven house. Okay, so we're at the abandoned house. This is a cute old house, you brat. This is brat. Oh my god. What are these two like dinosaur and girl? Like they're having a battle over here. But I, I don't I wouldn't call this house cute just because it's abandoned and it seems like no one took care of this house. Like, look at this. The stairs are not even good. There's like literally no windows. Like you can literally go through the window. I don't know. The windows are just broken up. It's, it just looks like a broken up house. And there's no like, as you can see, the, the kitchen looks all broken up and I, I would probably not eat anything in the fridge over here and look at this there's like a whole like section that's like cut out of the house like this is not, this is not good like the roof is gone if it rains then it's like it's just gonna fly like it's not good this house is so cute oh my god how how is it cute and the dinosaurs like i smell delicious food i mean I, I guess dinosaurs eat whatever they can right because i'm here duh okay you mean ugly oh my god <laughs> cleanse bodyguard playing this is my bodyguard right now and 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 they were defending me okay according to tiktok we have another scary secret in a Brookhaven house. I wonder what this is. I found something scary in Brookhaven and apparently he's going to go. Okay, he's going over to one of the houses over here. And what type of house is he going to get out? So he's going to get is that get this house out. Oh, that's a nursery house. I saw it. So basically the house he gets out is a nursery house. You know what? I'm, I'm going to get away from all these people. Let me go ahead and actually like get rid of this house. There we go. And now I'm going to go all the way over to Crown Pointy Community. Okay. And now we're going to go over to like the 24th house because because like it's, it's on top of the hill as you can see. Like it's literally on top of the hill and it's the best view and I'm going to get out the nursery house. There we go. I'm going to go to the nursery house right here. These houses aren't even scary. You might be right, but they're scary for me though. Try and ban me from your house. Apparently this person thinks that they can't get banned. Everyone can get banned. You know what? I, I'm, I, I can ban the girl, right? There we go. I, I just banned the girl. As you can see, the, the girl is banned. And let's go and see if I can ban the dinosaur. Okay, let's go and see. Let nope. me go and click on plan. Nope. What's going on? How can I not buy the dinosaur, bro? What? I'm clicking on it so many times. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna click on them again. Click on nope, it so many nope, times. Nope. What? Wait, wait. How? Like, is it good or something? Like, I can't ban them. He 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 he. I got banned, you brats. Yeah. <laughs> you can never ban me. I feel like I I can unban her, right? I'm gonna unban. Don't unban her. No, 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 don't slash unban. Which is players unban from house? Wait, how? How is this possible? What? All right, so Brookhaven is getting creepier and creepier, and creepier. I don't know what's going on, but as you can see. He enters the house and he's like, go to the kitchen. Okay, go to the kitchen. Okay, we're gonna go and enter the nursery root or nursery house, I guess. And we'll go to the kitchen. Hopefully, there's nothing like scary, super scary inside here. Or else I don't I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Like you guys gotta like and subscribe right now if you guys don't like scary things. Because this is something scary right now, right? Alright, and then what's gonna happen? Okay, he's gonna go up here, he's gonna jump up, he's gonna jump up. Okay, okay, okay. I really hope this isn't scary. So I'm gonna jump up. I'm gonna jump up exactly like he did in the TikTok. There we go. And it, it's it's kind of scary. It's kinda scary to jump up here. Anything could be here, you know, there could be ghosts here or something like that but let's go and see like okay i think i'm in i think i'm in and then what's gonna happen here what's gonna happen here oh my god there's two chocolate bars right here why are these two chocolate bars here i don't know like are we supposed to eat the chocolate bars maybe they maybe they're not good for you i don't know but, but let's go and eat them I, I i don't really know what's wrong with them or something okay and then what's gonna happen then what's gonna happen and then and then, and, 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 and wait that's where the tiktok ends wait